there was one last elf sneaking around under the floorboards. Which is my James 7 way of saying I forgot to activate stream avatars. You might be thinking, oh, Jamie, we're gonna kill you. Oh, J oh Jamie, we're gonna hurt you so fucking bad. You might be thinking that. Uh, so s s stop thinking that. <laughs> Who up and sick to their damn stomach? Late streamlet? I can uh, listen. This time. As, as with many other times, I have a good excuse. There was a bad storm here, so I couldn't turn on my computer. Wh and I wanted to turn on my computer because I wanted to make a new toy. Hm? You may now approve or disapprove of the streamer, of me. Thanks, Stream Elements. Now, a uh, key thing to note is that approving of me is much more uh, good to do. It's a good action. Supporting and approving of me is good. And disapproving of me is bad. Okay? Don't listen to what I'm, uh, I'm currently hiding something from the microphone. Yeah, I know I was late. I would, there was a big storm. There was a, a, a huge noise happened, okay? Just imagine the loudest sound that uh, you can think of. Late lit? Stop, stop. Hey, wh uh, whatever happened to Merciful Lit, huh? Did you see the TikTok mobile app turned into TikTok? Oh, did you see the Twitch mobile app turned into TikTok? It did. It's, oh my God. I just wanted to log on and I wanted to watch Sanity Plays games and it's so difficult to even like get to him. Literally the other night when I was like, I was on Sanity's stream when my power went out, right? Because of the storm. I'm always streaming during a damn storm. Um, I'm always streaming during a... Why are you surfing? Evie, thank you so much for the dollar. Who is this little man? Why is he surfing? Why are you all posting the surfing, man? How? What is this guy? Is that just like a Twitch global emote? Is he surfing? Clicking on him gives me no information. Can I copy-paste him? Is that allowed? It won't let me copy paste him. Chat, why are you hiding him from me? Paste. Whoa, yo, I can paste him. Can I paste him in Discord? Huh. I can. Okay, so you guys are just surfing at me because you're, um, immoral? Hmm. Nyim, nyim. Yeah, Jam, I was literally on your channel before you went live in the new app format, but it was so hard to find you. I don't like it. I really, it's, it's, you have to scroll through, like, everyone who's live at a time, and it's like, I don't want to do that. I want everyone on a menu, and I want to click who I'm looking for. Especially in the case where, like, my power went out. I had no way to inform Sanity that my power went out all, from the computer, right? Due to the power. So I had my phone. I launched the deliciously helpful TikTok app, right? And it's like, oh, Sanity plays games, you don't, you don't like that. You don't want to, you don't want to watch that, certainly. And it's like, I tune into every one of Sanity's streams. How does, how does the app literally not know? Hi. Hi, Mushrooms. I hate getting recommended channels as I'm watching streams. It's like really annoying. It's like genuinely really bad. Like, there are ways. Twitch could implement some sort of like discovery system, you know? Maybe they do more categories of like, hey, you can, you can, um tag yourself in different ways and we're doing a discovery week event you know meet some new streamers hang out in their chats and stuff but they don't how extremely late streamer let's play with them eh. Eh. i saw a movie today chat do you want to hear about the movie that i saw <laughs> or do you not want to be spoiled i haven't told you the movie's name but if you don't want to be spoiled i won't tell you anything else about it mm. Nah, no? Okay, well then I won't spoil you. I won't spoil any of you. My want is conditional? Mm. 
If it was Deadpool vs. Wolverine, shove it up your ass? I didn't watch Deadpool vs. Wolverine. <laughs> what? <laughs> why are you why are you so mad about an if statement? What's wrong with you? Get mad at me if I watched that. Was it old? What, like the beach that makes you go? No. It was a new movie. I got a okay. Okay, Rose. No, they're right for that. They're not right for that. You have to, you have to be sweet to me and, until proven evil. It's literally in the legal system. You have to be nice to me. <laughs> if your name is Jamie and everyone likes you, then do something bad to your elf. Okay. Well. Yup. Hey, don't disapprove of me. What the fuck? You spent six thousand spheres on disapproving of me, Woody. Stop it. It was probably some stupid movie like Nutrition Land 2. New, from the writers of Rick and Morty. No. Huh? If you must know, I can't tell you because chat voted for me not to tell you. Mmm. This drink is good. I won't share you- I won't share with you what it is, though. Hi! Potbelly pig boy, don't say that. Yum Homer the movie- stop posting about Yum Homer. Stop that. Damn, I wanted to know. I'll- I'll- it'll be tonight's sign-off VOD watcher message. If you're a VOD watcher, you'll learn about all my movie opinions. Oh my god, new. No. I forgot we had it! I forgot we had a command that makes a beautiful rock hyrax take up the entire screen. That's so beautiful. Nuh uh, can't spam it. It's got a cooldown and it won't tell you how much it is. I will pay for you to not tell us about the movie. Well, thanks for the one dollar. Um, I I won't tell you. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna say anything else about the movie until the VOD watchers. The VOD watchers might get to know. Unless you're paying me to censor myself for them, in which case it's gonna take more than uh, two wet dollars. I was gonna open a sodi, but it hasn't been in the fridge long enough for it to be cold. Fuck my stupid baka life. Hey, can we all can we all fuck green stupid baka life, please? Name your price. Wait, hold on. <laughs> I have to check my PayPal. <laughs> What's my price? What's my price to shut up about a movie opinion? Let's see. Let's see. Da no, I'm not downloading your damn app. Continue on web. Oh. 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 Three ninety. Hold on. Hold on. Give me a second. I because there's literally an online class that I want. I need to see if I have... Hold on. Give me one fucking second, chat. <gasps> oh! Fuck! I have literally exactly enough to buy the online courses that I want and nothing else. It would be literally the last of my money. Okay, so it's 20 bucks. It's 20 bucks, because I am about to be, what's it called, out for the weekend. Actually, you know what, you know what, you can, you can hold your donation, hold your donation, okay? No, Candy, I'm out of money too! <laughs> no! <laughs> Candy, I don't have any money! Anyway. <laughs> okay, so chat, 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 chat. I'm about to be out for two weeks starting Sunday. Because of that... I am going to be, uh, unable <laughs> to do much for that, and nor normally that's fine, normally that's fine, but I have subscriptions, right? I, I don't want to be hit with an overdraft fee, um, on, on thanks, hey, SucksBX, thanks for the follow, um, I don't want to be hit by an overdraft fee, uh, by things, so, basically, I am probably going to try to raise uh, a dollar or two on on sunday for um what's it called to, to just to just keep me covered uh while i'm out for surgery and get literally zero money um surge two -ery? no this is surge fivery 
My damn little cat ears on top of my head prevent me from making any money. Yeah. yeah. <sniffs> Sorry, I had to drink my water really beautifully. I'm gonna seal you in the halig tree? Don't do that. You don't have PTO? No. <laughs> Green, I work at a small business. I work at a business that sends me to the damn spider's house. I, I get paid two ants and a flea. Okay, I sent Candy $5. That's wonderful, Evie. Now Candy has $5. Hey, Jamie, I noticed a problem with your stream overlay. The word house needs to be blue. Fuck. God damn it. Easiest, easiest mistake in the book, and I make it. Ha house. Fucking, come on. Get blue. Yeah. Yeah. Come on, everyone. Go my house. Oh, oh, okay. Oh, oh, we all love Jamie until they spell a word wrong. My ass has been on paid vacation all week playing Far Cry 3. Ooh. I want to play Far Cry 3, but they don't let me. Um, anyway. Uh, so my, my whole damn... My whole, what's it called? My whole damn sob story about how I'm about to be making no little gaming coins is uh, mainly to say, like, on Sunday, I'm going to be, I'm going to be doing a bit of, um, uh, uh, either crowd control or Twitch spawn, I think, on a, on a different Minecraft modded world. Uh, and you will be able to maybe purchase to give me a block of iron or make a creature attack me. So choose well. Uh, I'm gonna hopefully not die tonight. Skyrim waiting room grows larger. Chat, put your name your favorite Skyrim character if you want me to play Skyrim when I'm back from surgery at some point. Roach, thank you. Save me from ah! save me from Valorant and something fell on me. What the hell? Your your creature fell on me. Name your price for not playing- Name your price for not playing Skyrim? What? Uh, you know, uh, chat, go have a civil war about that. Oh, that was me? Don't fall on me. Okay, uh, are you all ready? Are you all jumping and ready to see how cute, good, and awesome my house can be? Because it can all those things. Also, I don't know if any- I don't know if anyone noticed or remembered, but like... I don't know why my world is named this, but it's named- it's named PP World for some reason. Get out- get the hell off my overlay, thank you. I'm pretty sure I let chat name this place, which I don't like. I regret that decision. But I'm sure you freaks like it. Stop that, Roach. Okay, my house looks beautiful, by the way. My house looks beautiful. Why did you name it that? That's weird. I didn't do that, probably. There is, there is, that wouldn't, okay. For starters, that wouldn't make me laugh. Two, chat would make, chat would make me name a world like that on purpose to do something bad. This music is scary. It's gubble music, it's, it's beautiful. Here, we can skip this scary gubble track. There, now it's awesome rock music, okay? Yay, streamers playing PP pee, pee World again today. Ha 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 ha. Now, now you've pissed me off. I see how it is. Literally, my house is gonna be so beautiful, and you guys don't get it because we haven't gotten all of the correct uh, building materials. I noticed this the other day. All of these creatures need to shut the fuck up. I'm about to go and invent, invent, adventure. Oh, I thought we were gonna be making fun of your real house. I. Why would I? Why would I post a picture of my beautiful Minecraft house and then give everybody a tour of my real house? Ah. Okay. Here are our options, right? Do we ride along the coastline until we find other wood types? Or... <gasps> there, there, there! I want those! Give those to me! Let's go! Huh. Okay. Hold on. Real quick. Let's look at this thing, which tells us... Day 18?! <gasps> Holy shit! Witchy win! Thank you so much for the gift subs! That's very kind of you! Oh. 
I don't know why it plays the entire song. It's supposed to play about seven seconds of that, but thank you so much for all the, thank you so much for the uh, gift subs. That's very kind of you. Your wood greed is sickening? What the hell? Nova Rogue, hi. Hi, 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 hi. Everybody say hi to Nova Rogue in the chat. I don't know why I'm calling out Nova Rogue specifically, but it would be funny. Here, we're gonna make a Nova Rogue house. because I don't really want to use the birch wood that much. Here. This is going to be beautiful. Oh my god, we had just enough. Holy shit, speedrun tactics. There, Nova Rogue, quick, move into that house. It's so beautiful. Streamer incites harassment campaigns. I said, I said for everyone to say hi. I said for everyone to say hello. Um, Those seven steaks look good. Can I have one? Yeah, sure. Go, f uh, go get it. Hmm. Okay. The mountain is safe so far. I don't want to fall into piles of snow again. I don't want to get killed by uh, Freeze Meister and Hot Meister from Steven. Jamar, are you still playing with my Crown of Thorns texture pack? I don't think I am because I switched to Modrinth. I would have to. I would have to re-upload it. No, or no, it's probably still a uh, uh, recent in our DMs. Your toolbar is, as usual, fuck to shit. No, I just use glass panes, which means that's my building material. Um, can you add the tobacconist mod? What is that? Does that add, like, cigars? Cigarettes? What launcher are you using? I'm, u I'm using Modrinth. It is a new launcher to me, but I very much like it more than the other one, I think. Okay. Yeah, spruce sapling, that's what I needed. I'm not- I don't smoke cigarettes, chat. I don't support cigarettes, I don't support their work. Ripping that Minecraft tar? Stop. Don't pin PP streamer! Yeah, everyone- Oh, fuck. No, we are not doing a 500 cigarette speedrun. We are- we are building my beautiful house and in- and improving it until people believe me that- Oh, it's so cold. Until people believe me that my house is beautiful. If it kills me or you. Name your price for a 500 cigarette speed run. I don't know what that is! I added, uh, three points to my whiny stat in between streams, so I'm- very much hoping you're all prepared for just basically the most, uh, audio jungle hell of forever. You have to smoke 500 cigarettes as fast as you can? I don't- dude, I don't even want to smoke 400 cigarettes. I don't- I don't even want to smoke one. I'm anti- I'm anti-smoke. I'm anti-vape. Um, I'm anti- the devil. If you're the devil, please, uh, look away. Yeah, but you'd get so healthy. Wait, really? Looks at you with my big wet eyes. Blink, blink. I can be tricked by anything. Blink, blink. Wee, wee, wee. Hmm. I should invest in infrastructure. We need more... We need more warriors protecting our world. Protecting our me. Mainly me. I just need more iron golems because I want them to protect me. Hmm. And I need these- Ah! G dude, you freaked me out, man. God, this house is so awesome. Okay. This- the proximity to cows? No longer good. It was good at first. There was a time where it was good because I could walk outside and see cows whenever I wanted. But it was not good. There was once a young Christian boy who ate cigarettes every day who would eat more and more, and he would not die because he prayed while he ate the cigarettes. He ate so many cigarettes that he grew to a tremendous size. When the boy finally died, the priest wrapped him up in a great silken funeral cloth. It was then that the heavens opened, and from the clouds descended the hand of God, who plucked a tremendous cigarette boy from his casket. It was then that God lit a flame and smoked him. This is why we are anti-smoking. God will roll you up into a joint and smoke you. I think it's very obvious what the moral of the story is there. This will happen to you? No. 
Can you add a large tower of the wizard and or watch variety to your house? There is a watch tower right there, but it's not as large as it used to be because my house grew larger alongside it. And hey, can't that be beautiful? I want to, uh, you know what? I'm brave. Brave streamer. Running out in the middle of the night. Brave streamer. Day 19 brave streamer. Come on. Come on. We can do this. Hero. Hero. <gasps> can you add small little pests to your house? Oh, absolutely. I already live in it, my friend. There. There. I've planted a bunch of beautiful spruce. Now my house will begin transmogrifying, which is a new way to transmogrify, into something so beautiful that nobody will be able to die. Hmm, okay. A brick. I can use this. Man, these cows are annoying. Hmm. What do cows like? They like wheat. They are an animal, which means they can be tricked, corralled, and misled easily. I don't know what that guy's doing over there. Oh, he's kicking ass. Wait, I could go feed him. Dude, feed him. Come on, come on. We're gonna give you dinners. Yeah! Now give me that. Fuck yeah. Ooh. I have 39 of this left. How much do you need for an iron golem? No, you need like 50, don't you? You literally need 50 coins to get one of those fuckers. Damn. I swear I had some wheat in one of these chests. Where did you put my wheat? Chat, where did you put it? And my seeds, too. Where are my little seed berries? Oh, I found my seed berries. Okay. My sort of goal is to make it so that, like, this coastline is completely safe for little Jamies to live on. Um, but to do that, I would need some sort of way to light up the actual water. Holy shit! It's the humble Kawaka. Not Kawaka. Other animal. Thing. Okay, put those there. Turn these bones into... grass food. Do you guys think it's fucked up that bone meal is, like, real? Like, f like... Plants like eating humans as much as humans like eating plants. Well, I mean, I assume not all bone meal is made from humans, but the logic. Meal from bones. I actually agree. Blood meal is also a thing? Wait, what? What do you mean? Well, I don't like eating plants, so that doesn't apply to me. <laughs> Are you a carnivore? Are you a dinner king? Are you the dark king of dinner? Hmm. Blood meal is for plants? Okay, put that there. Okay, okay. Little guys, I have good news about your freedom meter. You've, you've spent enough patriot points to be relocated to a, what we in the business would like to refer to as a freedom shelter. Uh, which means, you will be twice up to three times as free as you were previously. Doesn't that sound nice? Oh my god. Okay. What? Go over there so I can do this. Oh, it's so beautiful. Oh, it's so beautiful. One. Guys, you are in the way. You are making my life so much more difficult right now for no reason. Dude. Okay, I'm gonna have to eat one of you. Vote amongst yourselves who is being eaten. Not you, chat. You hate animals? I don't. Okay, maybe these ones a little bit, but it's not their fault necessarily, so I'm not mad at them. They're just... They're just disappointing me, okay? There. Okay, everyone inside. Jane is being eaten. Don't eat me. Hmm. Okay. I can use my brick. Out of the way. My special brick I used. Okay, perfect. Um. You can't get out, but I'm just gonna put that there. You clone yourselves. You, your dinner. Perfect. Hold on. Hmm. 
There. No. There. Okay. That's... That isn't a permanent thing. That, those two spruce, but I had to. When will Jane be dinner? No. We are not doing the- we are not doing the dinner stream. I'm not fooling- I'm not falling for that shit. Oak door is what I need right now because I'm redecorating, yes. Okay. Okay. We finally have peace and quiet in my beautiful house. We can finally begin making something twice to three times as beautiful as as chat currently believes my house is because you know what fine fine i'll accept the existence of little haters I'm done. i would debate their existence but there's no need to because i can prove them wrong why do i have extra pants oh it's because i was wearing fishnets okay two times zero is still zero yeah nobody was questioning your math skills just like your eyesight skills with how cool my house looks and how bad it is too why is no one talking about the one green door? Everybody loves my green door. That's why. Nobody's talking about it because it is a, a widely popular area of my house. Everyone, talk about how much you love having one green door on your house. Hmm. Oh shit, it's James House. Hope that you won't get stuck in a cave again. Listen, we got plenty of materials doing cave fun, and we have a mine beneath the house. So, if anyone's getting stuck in a cave, it's not me. Did we also get diamonds? Man, there is a bunch of stuff I think we got. The next thing I need to do is go to hell. Where did my diamonds go? Did I not get any diamonds? Or did I just put them in a chest that I don't know about? Oh, right. I have a chest that I don't know about. I forget about my other chest every single day. Here. Why is this door open? Yay, little treats. Okay, okay. And I've even got music discs I won't be using. Okay, all of this, all of this shit is delicious. Let's take all of it. Mine under your own house? Homestuck confirmed? What does that mean? That, you know what? No, don't explain. I, I, I don't even think you're telling the truth. Sludge Gloption. Nope, doesn't make sense to me. I got the James 7 tea burger and it was too small and I didn't see it in my meal bag and I got mad and I threw it away and I asked for the, <laughs> I asked for the manager. They gave me another one or at least said they did and held out their hand and I'm dropping something into my palm. Suck ass waste of 1298. I'm gonna be completely honest with you. If there was a James 7 tea burger at McDonald's, uh, right, right, okay. Follow me in this world, right? Pretend I'm different. Pretend I'm Mr. Beast and McDonald's is serving the James 7 tea burger. Okay, now don't pretend I'm Mr. Beast. Stop pretending that. Pretend I'm like a a, a, a beastly equivalent, you know? I am I am like Germa, but if Germa was more public about making 80 billion dollars a second and Germa like started like ostentatiously f spending things, you know? Like, imagine if Jerma did, like, high-concept streams, right? But it was specifically, every single time, just to sort of show off his wealth. Like, you know, how Mr. Beast does. Imagine it's like, we bought an entire mall and did a first-person Rust stream inside of it, right? Okay, imagine that. Jame, have you considered the humble suck bug? Okay, okay. Imagine I spend all my streamer wealth making the humble suck bug real. Like, I get all my engineers in a lab, $8.6 billion spent into Project Suck Bug, right? Imagine I do that. And then... I forget where I was going in this scenario, because I would really like the suck bug to be real, y'all. I'm not gonna lie to you. Oh, right, the James 7 tea burger. Man, that would taste like shit. Okay. I really like the idea of having little grates in my basement that show me what time of day it is. This will keep me safer during the nighttime because I'll be able to work on my uh, house down here during the night, and I'll be able to work on my earth upstairs during upstairs. Jim, how are you making the house uglier? It's called construction. When you are working, when you are driving on a road, okay, pretend for just a moment that you're driving on a road. I know you have to render a lot to follow me in this imagination world, but I'm begging and pleading that you try, 
Okay. You don't criticize the fucked up roadways and stuff for being ugly because they're actively making it better over time, right? So I'm asking for you to try your hardest to do the same for me right now. Imagine that the mess that I'm making in the house isn't permanent, okay? Bioluminescent patty. Hmm, dinner. I am going to take some of this goo with me because two things I need this stream are an enchantment table and a nether portal because it is day 19 and everyone knows on day 19 you should already have a working uh, killer uh, or else you are fucked. Glowing meal patty. Uh, yum. Dude, if I could make if I could make a movie about like uh, the James 7 T burger, I totally would. Okay, here's my theory, right? You make a movie that's a parody of the Mr. Beast burger, but, uh, like a D-list content creator, right? Some Somebody who, uh, is not known, right? And this person gets their own burger. Not because, like, not because they made a deal, but because, like, Burger King thinks that, like, the rights to streamers are just something you can get. So imagine, oh, you know what? That would be a good Black Mirror episode, right? Imagine you go up to the uh, Black Mirror, um, not not the Black Mirror. Imagine you go up to the Burger King and you ask, uh, hey, can I get a burger? And they're like, oh yeah, but we have the uh, Mushrooms 33333 burger. And you're like, huh? And you Google that and it takes you to Mushrooms Twitch account. And it's like, and then Burger King's like, oh, or, or would you like the Green Lab Coat burger? Huh? The what? And, the, and then they have it. And they're all different flavors based not off of you, but of uh, what, like, an underpaid intern got from your internet account, right? Over eight seconds. Live on Twitch.tv, by the way. I'm telling you, I'm telling you a really good idea. The shit you hear on the bus when your headphones die? Did, uh, you, you guys don't even like me. Can you please talk about the Silly Billy allegations? Yeah, I jumped and smiled a bit, okay? Yeah, and I grinned a little. What of it? Nothing wrong with a little smile. Nothing wrong with a little bit of a grin. Okay? Chat, pay attention to where we are in relation into the 3D world. Cause, uh... Oh, wait, 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 no, I can use my eyes. Okay, our, our house is southeast from here. Okay, everyone remember- oops, didn't mean to screenshot. A screenshot! Okay, everyone uh, remember the word southeast for me, okay? Sodium renderer? I don't know what that means. Jumps at you. Leaps at you from the screen. Like, leaps at you really fucking fast. Why not just make a compass? Because I didn't bring my redstone. I brought a dolphin, apparently. Okay. Look at him. Does he tell the directions cardinally? No. Literally, wet dog. Can there be a meal of just sopping and bread in a bowl? I don't know, Gamer Krill. Have you ever been to Britain? It's like it's like what they eat there, I think. Sorry to all of the British. But the two foods you have are sopping bread in a bowl and can of pee. And brother, I'm taking the can of pee. That soup, bad soup, but soup nonetheless. That's all they have in Britain. <laughs> Quiet candy. Literally the base of a British sauce called bread sauce. No, no, the British do not have something called bread sauce. Take that back. I don't want to know that. Bread in milk and onion? No, no. no hold on, no, you're tricking me. You're tricking me. I'm, we don't have, we don't have fact checkers live on stream, okay? We can't afford them, but that pisses me off so bad. Jamie, you read about bread sauce on stream? We don't have rememberers on stream either, okay? We have a budget of small. I'm Snopes verified, Snoops true? Holy shit, that's two different organizations. We are so fucked. Do you not remember the Wikipedia list of sauces stream? Roncosis, I don't remember what I had for breakfast. I'm having a good time, not a long time. D uh, each time I have surgery is them resetting to the next Jane, but they realize that the number seven was the most marketable number. 
we only live for about, like, two years each. I'm not complaining. It's fine when it's my time to go. I'm just saying, like, I'm, get, I'm getting up there in months. Old. Okay, let's see. I bet your breakfast was round food. It was, it was fucking Pop Smarts. Not Pop Smarts. The cereal that is Rice Krispies? Crunchy cereal thing. They're small. They're flakes. They're flakes of some kind. Uh, frosted flakes. That's what they're called. The tiger. The tiger. You know him. The tiger. Hmm. So you lied. You can remember. Flakes are kind of round. I actually pretty genuinely disagree. They were like small and sharp and I actually got kind of scared I was going to choke on them. I don't eat frosted flakes often. Today may have been my first day eating frosted flakes, so you can consider me uh, one more type of cereal eaten on earth. Only three to go. Um, but I ate some of those this morning and they were like so small and like skittery. I, I genuinely thought I was fighting with like a small animal while I was at my breakfast eating. Frosted flakes are bizarrely, bizarrely sharp from what I remember. Yeah, literally, I, I genuinely thought they were gonna bite me on the way down. I got scared. You guys ever have Crave cereal? It sucks ass. Crave cereal, like with a K, like literally looks like some shit a modern Dracula would make. Oh, I've got, I've got them all hooked on my Crave cereal. My big vampire business is doing so well, the townspeople don't notice when I eat uh, one or two of them. Or maybe they do, and they just support small businesses. I don't know. Dracula. Modern Dracula doesn't want you to come eat the crave. <laughs> uh, oh my god, wait, Dracula literally wouldn't want you to come. Because of something something virgins, right? Badass. That's so cool. Crave is the name of a drug in a cyberpunk dystopia? Literally. Dude, cyberpunk Dracula would love that shit. Again, don't know why Dracula's involved, but I think it's fine. My mom eats a cereal called Morning Summon and it has whole ass almonds in it. You, I love almonds. You can't put those shits in cereal. They're fucking huge. If you put almonds in cereal, where's the rest of the cereal gonna go? Almonds are gonna take up the whole fucking thing. What the hell? They did it? They're perverse. Dracula should have been a cyberpunk book. Dude, I'm gonna... Wait, Dracula's in, like, the public domain now, right? We could rewrite Dracula chat. That could be a fun fucking stream. Let's... That's, that's, that's way easier than rebooting Galador. We'll do that first. For the record, the Galador reboot? That whole idea? Absolutely gonna do it. That's just, like, more of a milestone, capstone project once I learn enough about, like, 3D animation. Like, there will be periods of time where I don't mention it a while, right? Don't worry about that. It is, it is... I'm, I'm not saying I'm chipping away at it in the background forever. I am saying it is gonna be done and it's gonna be fucking silly. Hmm. Jane, we still have my evil Uno to play. From back, like, in March? I don't remember you making an evil Uno. Oh, right, I'm gonna be dying Monday, that's right. Evil Uno sounds fun. Candy would like that. Jim, can you tell us what you think happens in Dracula? Uh-oh. I mean, yeah, I can. Why do you want to know? Oh, okay, okay, no, it's Bram Stoker's Dracula, right? Like, with John... John... You know, John Smith, I don't give a shit. He's, he's a guy. He's a guy named John, right? John Stoker. John Stroker, right? John Stroker goes to Dracula's house after a long night of being broken down on the side of the road. That's his day job he goes to. He breaks down his cart on the side of the road. After a long night of that entire happening being done, he goes to uh, Dracula's house, knocks on the big old door, and says, Oh, hello, hello, is anybody home? And you know who comes, you know who comes out at the door and answers it to? Well, it's Dracula. Motherfucker, John Stroker thinks. It's the damn Dracula. I've heard about this guy. He's a, he's a fucker. He does weird Dracula experiments in his Dracula puddle, okay? I imagine it's sort of like a, a cave of black goo that Dracula goes into. Um, it's like an open coffin that he sinks in. 
and then he does his Dracula experiments. Um, and so uh, John Stroker is invited into this terrible house, and uh, Dracula's all like, Oh, want you stay a while, eh? Yay! <laughs> and, and well, John, I mean, come on, come on. Come on, so it, he's charming. Dracula, Dracula's charming. He's got a little bit of a he's got a little bit of a, a beautiful flair, right? He's got a little bit of a beautiful flair. His eyes sparkle a little bit because of his Dracula. Um, hate having to mop up my Dracula puddle. No, uh, uh, no, it's like a it's like a ferro fluid is what it is. It goes back into the puddle after he gets all his Dracula juice everywhere, and so it's fine. And you don't even need to clean it up. It's fine. Um, so I imagine that like. Uh, after all that, uh, John just sees a whole bunch of, uh, creepy stuff. I assume. I assume John just sees a whole bunch of creepy and badass stuff. Nah, ferro fluid, messy as hell. No, this is like Dracula fluid. It's like, it's fine. It, it cleans up itself, okay? That, it, it's, it stains everything, but Dracula fluid doesn't, okay? I'm saying visually it's like ferro fluid, as in, like, it, it flows and it has a mind of its own. Don't worry about it. It's a, it's a scary story from the 1920s? I don't know when, when Dracula was made. Hmm. But, like, I know that there's other characters in the book of Dracula, so I assume that, um, there's, like, characters. <laughs> yeah, there likely would be. So I assume there's probably, like, some maidens and damsels. They had those a lot in the 1920s, but the genus went extinct. Um, I assume John watches them get dracula or maybe they are already dracula and maybe they're like his psychic minions. I assume that if there's multiple maidens, they sort of like move as like a unit through the house, you know? And he has to sort of like, uh, uh build little barricades and stuff to avoid Dracula maidens. That would be really cool. That would be really cool if if Dracula's house had crafting and a uh, leveling system. I assume it didn't, but you know what? No, it actually did because John has to level up his Dracula knowledge to defeat Dracula, right? So that's kind of like a leveling and crafting system. Again, I assume this is pro uh, a pre Die Hard type of uh, book, Dracula book, right? I'm so lost. Well, John, John Stroker isn't in Dracula's big mansion. That's how he survives. He does not get lost in the big mansion by the end. He has to like replay the day that he like crashes his car on the side of the road every day until he gets it right and does a perfect run of Dracula's mansion. James, what does Igor do? Holy shit, is Igor from Dracula? Dude, is Igor from Dracula? Don't lie to me right now. If Igor's from Dracula, I'm gonna be so fucking happy. Yes, no, what, yeah, no, nobody, it's not, no, no lol. He literally is. Okay, so lots of liars in the chat and a few helpful truth tellers. So, Igor is clearly Dracula's servant. I know this because of sort of how he was. I love that. Imagine the etymology of Igor, right? You're like this, you're like this shitty little dude from Dracula, and you become more famous than Dracula very briefly, but then people come around to the idea of Dracula, but they don't associate you with each other. So then, uh, Dracula and Igor are always considered, like, these separate things, but they're actually, like, work buddies. That's so interesting. Uh, he's totally not from Dracula, is he, now? You, you have lied. Okay. But I would... His name's Renfield, but he's Igor to me? That's why I thought Igor was in there! Oh my god, I watched the movie Renfield. Because that had Nicolas Cage as Dracula. That wasn't the movie I watched today! That wasn't the movie I watched today. I did not watch Renfield today. I watched a different movie. Uh, which I can't tell you about. Or wait, I can. Unless I'm, I'm given enough money to buy my silence. Mm, much to think about. James, the famous line is... Igor, bring me the brain. What is Dracula doing with a brain in a jar? Oh, what is Dracula doing with a brain in your AU? Oh, Dracula's- oh my god. Dracula's building something fucking badass. I think- okay, okay. 
if Dracula had a, had like Igor bringing him brains and and stuff, I think that he would build. I I think he would be building a rival to Frankenstein. I think he would be building it an an anti Stein probably some sort of like badass like punching mech. Maybe that's it. Yeah, maybe Frankenstein like got one over on him like too many times, and he's like, Igor, my boy, this is fucked up. That dipshit Frankenstein has outdone me at the scary games for nine years in a row. Well, we'll get him this time. And they're meddling dog, too. I imagine that because of him being in the public domain, Scooby-Doo and friends can show up as well. Uh, which would be awesome. Oh, Scooby-Doo and friends are not public domain. I Guys, I wish public domain was like a virus you could catch. Okay, here's my idea. Right, so Scooby and the gang crossed over with Dracula. I think that means Scooby and the gang should be in the public domain now too. And I think this law should be retroactive. So like the moment, the moment that it goes into effect, everything is copyright free forever. Frankenstein is non-binary in your continuity? I think that would be cute. I think it would be cute. Okay. Nothing nothing wrong with 18 more thousand non-binary characters in all of fiction. Nothing wrong with uh, removing every cisgender character in all of fiction. I think it would be funny. Okay? We don't even need to replace them with anything. It would be far funnier if we didn't. Why are you doing this? Nothing wrong with doing that. Nothing wrong with doing anything. Nothing wrong with a little bit of gaming to hurt people. Nothing wrong with a little bit of gaming to deliberately hurt, mislead, or injure people. But yeah, uh, genuinely, I don't, I don't imagine that um, uh, much happens in Dracula. Can you go back to fixing what you call house? I am. I didn't communicate my intentions here, but I need iron to get uh, little snippers because I need little fucking snippers to get uh, wind. Wind? Little wind pieces. Green? Leaves. No, not leaves. The leaves that grow downward. Down leaves. Vines. Yup. That's the one. Wind egg elf. True. Roots. Another good guess. What? <laughs> Iron. Yay. 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 Yippee. <laughs> Gets really happy. You had like 40 iron. Not in my inventory. I started my I, I started my journeyous exploration. James, have you had any round food today? I had a baby bell cheese uh, as the stream was starting. I had a baby bell cheese as the stream was starting. I'm digging for iron. Mrs. the iron. You are lying to me. You're trying to trick me. You're trying to you're trying to drive me nutty, like the like the movie The Nut Job. Yep. I don't like that they call the movie the nut job. I get that the joke was to be crass, but like the farther we get into the future, the more crass that name sounds. You passed by iron like three times? I didn't, liar. No, genuinely though. Like leave those damn like leave those damn squirrels alone. That's not a good reference, I think. What do you mean? The movie the nut job? They lit it's real! That name is not meant to be crass. It literally super clearly is. Nut job is a term? Oh! Oh. <laughs> I thought- I thought they meant it as like a sex thing! Oh my god! Whatever. Whatever. It doesn't refer to what you thought it did. I- Whatever. Whatever. Wait, that wasn't a bit- WHY WOULD I- It- It has job in the title! It- Everything else crass does! Explain what you thought a nut job was in detail? I wouldn't be able to say that on Twitch! Thank you! My hit movie nut stroker? Yeah, like, literally! Like, li Okay, that- <sighs> I don't need to defend myself because everyone understands me. Everyone understands what I meant. Everyone understands what I meant. I was criticizing the title of the movie clearly. I was- I was literally- 
<laughs> I was literally... Everyone understands. Wait, what do you think a full-time job is? I don't know. Some sort of suck and fuck that never ends. I don't give a shit. No, that one was a joke. That... That... That sentence out of my mouth was parody. The previous one, I did genuinely think... <laughs> I did genuinely think that movie was called something different for some different reason. Yay. Yippee. Yippee. Yup, and they're gonna hurt me real bad until I stop moving. Well, whatever. Okay, I have everything that I needed from this stuff. I have vines. I have... Give me you. Man, fucker. Stop dodging. Okay, I have all everything I need. I'm literally not a Doom streamer. I'm genuinely not a Doom streamer for that, okay? God! I seriously went, like, two decades thinking that the... Thinking that that movie title was a sex reference. Oh my god. This... That's fucking me up. I need to go- I need to go home and never think about Scrat and his friends ever again. Scrat is from Ice Age. There's no hope for you. Scrat is from Ice Age. You aren't recovering from that? Shut up. Shut up. Jane, you have to be a tulpa? Of what? Of who? What does it- I have to be a thought form? Who's thinking of me? Aw, is someone thinking of me? Hold on. Is, is someone thinking of me? <laughs> you have to give me their name. You have to tell me if someone likes me. <laughs> I can't. Hey, Soppy. I cannot. Slut. <laughs> Come on, man. <laughs> Thanks for the subscription. <laughs> oh my god. Gotta go get pizza. Good job with your stream. Oh, thank you. Thank you. I hope I'm going the right direction. Southeast, yeah. Oh my god, it's a hamster. Ooh. Ooh. This is going to be remembered? God, I hope not. I hope this isn't another fucking jeans biting me incident. Do you know I still get asks occasionally, like, of people being like, Oh, oh, why are you late? Did your, did your jeans cut a swath through your little streamlet flesh and make you bleed everywhere. And I don't- I- I can't engage. I can't let more people know about, like, the time that I apparently accidentally mauled myself trying to put on some jeans. James should be the protagonist of the Divine Comedy 2. I hope the Divine Comedy is a sweet little story where it's really nice for me. I hope it's real sweet and good. Every time you speak, it's so profound. We have to profind ourselves a way home. Smiles really bigly and hopes nobody kills me. <laughs> the sisterhood of the traveling pants is trying to put you in the ground, Jame. You gotta leave the city. Do you guys remember the Jimmy Neutron episode where the pants were, like, uh, coming alive and, like, eating people and hurting them? That shit scared me as a kid. I was like, oh my god, those people are dying. Oh my god. How are Jimmy Sheen and the other one gonna get out of this one? They're- they're just gonna- Dude, they're gonna get killed by their pants. That and the pizza episode really freaked me out, okay? Don't disapprove of me, Cosma Spiral Knights! You're- Come on. Come on. Hey. Hey, James, someone disappeared? What does that mean? Crafting table left behind? What? I'm not- no, I'm not taking my crafting table. I- why would I need that? It's my world. Littering is good for it. If I leave the crafting table there, that means I'll know I explored that area in the future. I'll know where I got these vines from, in case I use all of them by accident to make one single mossy cobblestone. That's just really mossy. It brings the rest of the ecosystem together. Your reading comprehension is suck? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh. oh, yeah, actually. Human person lad said, hey, James, someone disapproved. I thought you said disappeared. Smiles really cutely. You could have saved, like, a stack of wood by now? No. I couldn't have saved anybody. I have to let them go. James can't decipher one word title of a movie, so... What? It, uh, what do you mean? Oh, yeah, the movie we were talking about, right. I was like... <laughs> I was like, what do you mean? 
I was like, what do you mean? You, you think I don't know what the movie Smile is gonna be about? Yeah, you, you don't think I know that they're gonna be smiling in that movie? That wasn't the movie either, chat. Don't worry, I'm not spoiling it. The, uh, the movie Smile was so funny. I will, spo I will spoil Smile today, right now. If you're gonna watch Smile, don't look at me right now. Holy shit, is that a little thing? What is that? What are you? Can we all grin? You can grin. What is that? Oh my god, are those all drowned? Are they being cooked the damn alive? Why? Okay. Free treats for Jamie. Please tell me there's not actually a movie called Smile. There is. It's a horror movie. Ow! Of course it's- of course it's A, real, and B, a horror movie. Why would I lie about- Sorry, I had to do a really small hiccup. Why would I lie about- <gasps> Let's go! Big win. Mending. Why would I lie about either of those things? Sorry, I got mistracked by my thoughts several times in the middle of a sentence. Not my fault, though. Everyone forgive me forever. Whee! Okay, now we follow the coast till I'm home, I think. More like snorer movie? Soppy, did you not like Smile? Did you not watch Smile? Or are you just being mean? Use exclamation point detritus to sprinkle James' world with various junks. You know what word got your message hidden, stock image? It was, it was, uh, various junks, apparently. I can't, you can't say anything about junk on Twitch. I care not. Oh, yeah, okay. Uh, Herd Chef. Herd Chef Soppy, your new name. Uh, because he's cooking? No, because he's poisoning. They call him the Poisoner Chef. Um, Southeast. I accidentally made another screenshot. Northeast. Uh-oh, was I going the wrong way? No, I wasn't. Okay, I'm fine, I'm fine. I'm literally good, I'm literally good. We're fine. Everyone get happy. Everyone get curled up in a little ball. Dude, I genuinely think there should be, like, armadillos the size of hamsters. That could possibly be one of the only ways to improve the, like, genus of hamster, is if they could get, like, armored shells. So they wouldn't, like, be detonated by as many different animals and enemies. That's called Pillbug? I like Pillbug. I'm friend- I'm friend and ally to the Pillbug Empire, but... I am saying that if we were to give a hamster the power of an armadillo and the recklessness of a hamster, we could really see some big changes in politics. Get out there and vote, people. Get out there and vote for Kamala Harris to genetically engineer the new armored hamster. Not get her to fund genetic engineering. Get her to make it herself. Too many politicians, see, they just, they get into the office and they shirk their responsibilities. Kamala should go find enough, I, I don't know, how, how would you get the concept of an armadillo shell onto the hamster, okay? How do you, how do you do that without without just sort of fucking everything up about the hamster and the armadillo. Surgery? No. Wrong. You have to- you have to make sort of its own thing. Jim, what are you talking about? I'm- I'm trying to picture genetic engineering, but I don't get it. It's too confusing. <laughs> Gotta smush them together in a vat of goo. Okay, thank you. Okay, that actually clears it up for me a lot, okay? I get it now. Unethical suggestion? Nuh uh. Into the vat of goo with you. Woody, we're adding you to the hamster. We're adding you to the hamster dillo, and you're not coming out until you're born. Yup, you're new now. Fund my pages? Fuck. That's, a, that's such a good fundraising call to action. Kamala should, uh, hire you. Hmm. The weird goo that made the turtles ninja. Aw, that's so beautiful. Woody, don't do that. Wait, you didn't even do that. You did a poor- you did a, a- a poor imitation of a disapproval. That's perturbing, my friend. You've perturbed me. Okay, let's make a little vineyard. 
but like literally for vins, vines. I like how vineyards, vineyards, I like how vineyards are supposed to be allegedly for um, those little fuckers that make wine, grapes, grapes and different things that make wine, right? Fermented fruits, maybe, clementines, um, but they're called vineyards. Like, why don't you just grow vines? Why don't you just ferment vines, really? Did any vineyards ever consider that? We could get a lot out of that. You're a fermented fruit. <laughs> Soppy, you're blue now. Why are you blue? It's so weird not seeing you be green. It's really upsetting me and a lot of other people. Okay, it's mostly just upsetting me. I did lie about all the other people that it was upsetting. Nobody tell them? Nobody tell me what? <gasps> Do they actually ferment them? Do they actually ferment the vines? Dude, I'd be so fucking happy. They don't grow vines because they grow for free. Look up Kudzu game. Kudzu is nice. I like it. Are you colorblind? Jame? What are you all talking about? I don't know how wine is made. They they do the they do the thing with like the wine berries. Fox Valentine, thanks for the follow, I think. One, two, three, four, five. Five. Wine berries are different. <laughs> Again, another really good idea for a new fruit food they should make. The humble wine berry. Dude, this is literally the most ideal situation um, to uh, harvest vines from. They're gonna grow from up there to down there, and then I can harvest them with my little snippers. Dude. Can you believe that? Can you believe how convenient it is? It's really good. Wine berries aren't supposed to be eaten, you know? I mean, yeah, it's like a crab apple, right? You're not supposed to eat a crab apple. Not because it'll hatch into a crab. They're not related to crabs. I assume. Hmm, this is beautiful. <laughs> eat egg 24, that's so sad. Unrelated, have you ever been caught in a mouse trap? Oh my gosh, we used to have little mouse traps that were like the the no-kill mouse traps. Um, we don't have mice around here anymore, but when we did, um, uh, I never wanted them to get hurt ever in my life. So we, I, I basically pestered my parents into letting us get the like no-kill traps. Um, and every morning before school, I would run out into this like zero i would run out across the street right and and put the mice out into a field across the street and because i was a moron that's not actually like to me i'm thinking okay this is the impossible journey of the mouse right the mouse can never get back here because it's just simply too long do you know how fucking fast mice are they were back in their ho like little mouse homes by the afternoon we were just giving them infinite peanut butter basically they, they figured out an exploit where it was like, oh hey, if someone's stupid enough not to murder us on sight, we get infinite peanut butter. Um, but I guess we were just bad landlords, because one day the mice stopped showing up. Or maybe we had bad peanut butter? The service was maybe terrible for them. Jane, please use less cobblestone, I'm begging you. Why? I'm not gonna run out. Oh, like you don't like cobblestone. Oh, I see. Sure, sure, sure. Imagine I'm like rolling my eyes a little bit. Like I'm clearing I'm clearly being like a little bit dismissive, but like not enough to be rude. But it's getting there. It's bordering on rude, I would say. Use cobblestone fence for that pillar. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. Is that how you got bit and became a weremouse and that's why you don't stream on a full moon? <laughs> Cause they shrink down. Cause they shrink down so small. Aw. Jame, I want you to know there's a lady on YouTube who catches housemates, takes care of them for a bit, and then releases them all together in the woods far away. Aww. Hey, stop. That's beautiful. Now I want to be a house mouse. Aww. We used, <laughs> we used live traps and then left them out many miles away <laughs> where they were someone else's problem. That's, like, genuinely twice as beautiful. That's genuinely twice as beautiful. House of Meeves? Aww. Like a me like a single Meeve. Or as we like to call them, a mouse. Hmm. Okay. 
I could improve my house by giving myself a stairwell here into my wet basement. Not wet yet. Is that like alien abduction for those mice? Uh, yeah. I would hope so. Because that would imply alien abduction for humans is not actually that scary. We're just being, like, studied a little bit. Dude, imagine an alien, like, abducts you and, like, puts their, like, little alien tracker on you and they're like... Which is like, oh, you're being so good. Here, here, we're gonna put a little tracker on you and then we're gonna release you into the wild. But they, like, fuck up what your natural habitat is and you're on, like, Sleebnar after that. Imagine you get re-released on the wrong fucking planet. Yeah, I've read that porno. Getting re-released on the wrong planet? By Plebnar and his little stupid buddies? You could improve your house with 900 bugs? I could improve my house with much less bugs than that, my friend. Not really a problem. Yeah, beautiful. I read a short story about something like that, actually. You're gonna say something silly in your next sentence. You're gonna say something silly like, Oh, and it was called Stupid Dumb Ideas by an Idiot. Wait, Soppy, how'd you redeem that? Is it already time for an on-screen celebration? I still can't see those. I still don't know what they look like. I keep forgetting what to look at them, I mean. Not what they look like, because I haven't seen them. I don't know what they look like in the first place. Hey, who saw me? Sorry, sorry. I was I was preemptively getting mad. Okay, let's go down here. The aliens made an artificial habitat but underestimated the amount of calories it takes to kill and prep an entire deer. The punchline was that the aliens were grad students. Aww, that's cute. I, I genuinely would be fascinated if, like, it turns out the gray aliens were real and, like, they, they, like, admit, like, oh, yeah, we were kidnapping people and studying them for centuries. No, we're not sorry. We're incapable of feeling your human emotion of sorrow, regret, remorse, or the other ones. Uh, but for diplomatic reasons, we would like access to all of Earth's giraffes. We don't have them on Plebnar World, and we would like some. Yes, all of them. That's actually how they probably- that's probably how the iPhone was invented. We probably traded a secret animal away to them forever. What do you think? Both doors green now? Even more than that soon. What are you doing? Oh, you need food. Here, have a drink. What animals would they have on Plebnar? I mean, probably just, like, gray alien animals, right? Okay, okay, imagine, like, imagine we're on human Earth, and a gray alien is, like, a little human, but gray and alien. So I assume, like, most of the shit on Plebnar is just, like, like, it's a cat, but smaller and gray and m more malicious, maybe. <laughs> Sawblade, locust, fast looker, sheep. <laughs> the three animals on Plebnar, and now giraffe. Yeah, gray alien lion and gray alien frog. Yeah, right? Like, I feel like the gray alien planet wouldn't exactly be that complicated. Like, they're gray aliens. They're, they're simple folk. They abduct things. They probe them. They throw them back into the water. Catch and release. They're, they're stupid. You started talking about Plebnar and it crashed my computer? Please take that as a serious reason to get into conspiracy theories and come back in 20 years when you have changed as a person for the worst forever, okay? Please and thank you. Can you find your newt? I cannot. I don't know where a newt is right now. Dude, if I had a newt with me, that would be awesome. That would be that would basically just include a lot of different things. Hmm. This is my basement. I can live here underground. It is safe down here. Oh, I fucked it up bad. Wrong block. Boop. Yay. Dude, I love the different, like, chiseled bricks they've put in Minecraft. They're so beautiful. Oh my god, the Joker is huge. Sorry, had to comment on the size of the Joker. Hmm. 
I don't like, um, I don't like when the Joker gets, like, huge and big in, like, Batman stories and stuff. I don't think he should have superpowers. I don't, I don't think it's ethical for DC writers to give the Joker superpowers because he is a villain, right? The Joker is the villain of the series, and I really feel like that the writers of Batman and Friends maybe don't get that because they keep seeming to, like, give him different powers and gadgets and abilities to make him fight Batman and hurt Batman. And I just don't really get why they're doing that if they want Batman to win. Why don't they just... It, like, okay, so if the Joker... If the Joker is an asshole and Batman can't kill, right... Why doesn't some other guy just kill Joker for Batman? So beautiful. There's a reason that big block variety model was called Chisel, and it's because Chisel Minecraft blocks are badass. Huge fucking, huge fucking agree. I actually agree hugely. Hence why I said that I do. I could make a lantern or two. Would you like me to make a lantern or two? Or am I barred from the sort of thing? Is it illegal for Jamie to do? Up here. Okay, is this safe? Yeah, I think this is safe, but I need to make it slightly safer. Do you have any tough? I do not have any tough. I don't know where to get tough. Is it like only at geodes? Where do you get tough? Hmm. Dirt. Thing. Wood. I could probably squish you down my hands into a tiny little cube and not do anything with it ever. What the hell? Well, I guess maybe you could. I wouldn't like that. Someone killed Joker and Batman just sort of kicked the dirt for a while. Fucking loser. Dude, if somebody killed my arch nemesis that I wasn't allowed to murder... I will- I would, like, give them some serious head, okay? Batman can do anything but give head, because he fucking sucks. He's bad at his job, he's bad at protecting crime, he's bad at having lots of money. Because notice how I, in every Batman story he has a lot of money? Idiot. Like, why does he have all that? Is he stupid? Boing, boing. Would he stop doing that? I think if someone kills the Joker, then Batman should have a heart attack? Why? Again, if somebody killed my nemesis, I would be like, damn, are you doing anything later? L literally, Catwoman doesn't have anything wrong with, like, killing people, I don't think. Or maybe she does, I don't know. I haven't asked her. I'm not gonna ask her. Um, seriously. <laughs> That's awesome, Box Valentine, me too. Yeah, it's a soul link. God, idiots. Shouldn't have gotten their damn souls linked like that. They shouldn't have gotten matching womb tattoos. That's the problem. That's what links your soul with someone else's. Don't ask me how I know. Blink, blink. Oh, there's more stuff. Oh, this is like underneath my stairs. Hold on. I could do something cute with this. Yeah, Soppy, I would. That's why I said that I would. What do you- what's the problem? Pushes you? Pushes and kicks you? Hmm. Eh? Hmm. Hey, Jane, can you design a universal chat tattoo so we can all become a weird hive mind? No, I am not getting a matching womb tattoo with all my chat. Last time I'm asking. I mean saying. I'm not asking. I'm saying I'm not gonna do that. Stop asking, is what I mean. <laughs> hey, can you- thank you. Sorry, I was about to yell at the, uh, construction guy there. Coward streamer? Fine, for <laughs> one gift sub, we'll all get a matching boot tattoo. <laughs> Sorry, I really like the idea, the gag idea of like being really adamantly against something, like falsely, and then being like, okay, fine, if I have to, for one gift sub, I'll do it. Um, that's silly to me. I find humor in this. Okay. How am I gonna make this not correct? I mean, correct. You're a slut? Yeah, yeah. What's- and- and what's wrong with that, Soppy, huh? 
holds the mic out to your little creature mouth. Huh? Are you gonna say there's anything wrong with that? Oh no! My damn basement is flooded! How could Soppy do this? Meh. Fix that fucking wall? What do you think I'm doing? Literally. Literally eat egg 24. <gasps> Wait, I could have a secret wet exit. Let's fucking go. <laughs> Wait, is that entire song playing for a single gift sub? Oh my god. <laughs> Pyromantic feline Trimbus, thank you so much for the gift subs. Well, everyone, I guess we all... Oh, anonymous gift subber. Thank you so much. Welp, let's all get a matching womb tattoo, chat. Smiles really widely. Delves back into the mines for a hundred years. Oh, wait, I need... <gasps> I need different... I need different. I need different. Evie, thank you so much for the gift sub. Why are you all showing so much enthusiasm for this idea? Wait, what do you mean we're gonna run out of... Are you saying that we have to get... Are you saying that we have to get... A, a, a different one each time? Are you saying we have to get a different one each time? Like, for all of them? Why? Team has to get a womb tattoo for each sub? Come on. Gets really angry and jumps up and down. Hold on. We need more materials. We need something. Womb tattoo fan art contest one. At, at one thousand dollars. <laughs> can I? Can I? Are you allowed to make promises like that? Like I'm joking, okay? I'm joking for TOS sake. But that'd be really funny if you totally could. Anonymous gift sub. Thanks for to Gubble. Crosses my arms angrily. Wait, no, I love Gubble. Smiles. I don't understand this bit in the slightest. Yay. Do you not know what a wound tattoo is? Come on. Fox Valentine, thank you so much for the gift sub. Happy. You did a tier one sub to $1,000. Hey. <laughs> hold on. Hey, hold on a second. Are you, are you allowed to, are you allowed to skirt the rules like that? Smiles really sweetly. What should my, oh, there we go. I needed cobbled deep slate. That's what I needed. This is gonna be beautiful. We're gonna make a beautiful house. Why am I hearing so many cr critters above me? Hello, everyone. You don't even have a job. Oh my god. I need more paper. I need paper. Thank you so much for the subscription to Gubren Anonymous. Why? Wait. Oh my god. I genuinely, I genuinely thought Gubrun was the name of a game for a second. I'm so scared. Hmm. Okay, let's see. Oak fence, oak slabs. I need to be out of my house for a bit while those guys make their noises because I feel like my forehead is gonna start bleeding. I don't think that's a normal bleed. I don't think that's a normal place for to have bleeding from. But it felt like that because of all those men singing. Normal? Yay, it's normal. It's so normal. Yay. God, there are villagers everywhere. What's wrong with them? It's like I live in a village. Perverse. Hmm. My eye has started bleeding regularly and that's normal. You're good. Yay, yay! Boing, boing, boing. Those were three happy bounces. Hmm. Who's meowing? Not me. Someone check on Soppy. He might have meowed. If he does, he'll be in trouble. Jame, the ominous music is back. We love ominous music. It's too scary. It's fine. Look, the sun is going down. That means it's fine to be scary for a bit. Chat, everyone get scared of something. Chat, everyone list your favorite fear, okay? Not your biggest fear, your favorite fear. Your favorite thing that you're scared of. 
Mine is... Ooh, actually, what is mine? What am I scared of that is my most favorite? Hmm. Probably the analog stuff? Of horror? Of you couldn't save them fame? Hey, thanks for approving of me. Probably these. Porcelain dolls, that's a good one. Hmm. Fear of Heights is fun because I climb stuff anyway. I think, yeah, I think Fear of Heights is probably mine because I like roller coasters, which means roller coasters are double as fun because they're scary too. Ma mm, no, maybe actually my favorite fear is uh, fear of like being crushed by a mechanical apparatus. Because it's like, okay, okay. That's my favorite fear, not in the sense that I would like to be crushed by a mechanical apparatus. I wouldn't. If you're thinking of birthday gifts for me, do not crush me by a mechanical apparatus. I would not like it. I'm saying, like, that's my favorite fear in sort of, like, the, uh, uh, in the sense that of everything that I am conceptually scared of, that is my favorite conceptual fear because it's, like, so vague and out there. You know, I can say I'm scared of bugs, but that's not really my favorite fear, because I don't even want to be scared of bugs, and I'm not scared of every bug, and I want to be able to enjoy bugs, because lots of other people on Earth enjoy bugs, and find them beautiful and wonderful, right? So I'm not gonna shit on bugs, or take that away from anyone, so that's not my favorite fear. But, nobody likes being crushed by a giant mechanical apparatus, right? So, by that metric, I can kind of, like, be fine with the fear of that, you know? One, two. See? Now I can spy on visitors. Uh, no, I can't, actually. I can just look at people's feet. So kind of an L if you're Jamie, but I guess it could be a W for someone else, so... There's potential resale value in this house, I guess. Hmm. <laughs> now you can get rainwater in through the front porch. <laughs> Let's fucking go. Thank you, Muddy Dirty Paws. I officially know where my resale market is. Thank you. Stone brick wall. Stone cobblestone. Make you into these. Yeah. Oh, you made a James size door underneath the stairs? Nuh-uh. Where'd my door go? Oh, there's my door. Clearly I cannot fit under there. It would be really funny if like a skeleton kills me through like a trick shot in that like exact little angle. I'm afraid of power tools, TBH. I don't like the idea of getting my arm turned into ground beef. See, literally, like, a, a wood chipper is actually, like, something that freaks me out. Do you know how easily a wood chipper could bite you, and, like, if it gets you just once, that could be it? They should relabel those things to have, like, poisonous stingers at this point. Like, you should be, like, a licensed architect to play with a, a wood chipper. And I'm only partially kidding, because those things are fucking scary. Literally the mangler? Yeah, I mean, yeah. Literally the mangler. It literally mangles. Jame Chipper? No! No! Wood Chipper? Come on. Come on. Crushing Apparatus Lover 64 just tipped one dollar and says you speak only lies. <laughs> Well, I'm sorry for speaking lies. Hmm. Yeah, I think I like these little leaves here. I think it's rather beautiful. And I'm gonna turn these into little places as well. Lie squeaker? Uh, yup, I squeaked so gently, and I lied. Yup, I lied about squeaking, everyone. I did totally squeak when you weren't looking. Oh my god, wait, hold on. I could make secret tunnels beneath the earth. Who up and making secret tunnels? <laughs> Three more months of this shit and he'll have half a stack. Oh, let's fucking go. You can you can turn all that into a villager and you'll get a crisp emerald. God, I wish I was making secret tunnels. Let's be real, you do wish that. What was I looking for earlier? Obsidian. I have not seen any fiery big stupid lakes where I could turn them into big stupid piles of obsidian. Have I, chat? I've only seen one toxic lava flow that turned into a toxic lava flow. 
and that's not multiple. The crushing apparatus says... Oh, I don't actually see what the crushing apparatus says. Weird. The crushing apparatus is tipped one dollar, and it's not telling me anything else. Gets really scared. Wait, that's literally scarier than if I knew what you said. I don't like that. Hmm. You can make genuine rat tunnels if you use trapdoors and pistons to force yourself into a crawling state. I do know that, but that's not really a thing I need to do. <laughs> I'm going to go to bed. Good night, crushed lit. What the hell? Gets visibly upset. Ooh, hold on. Hangs a lantern from the ceiling and then gets visibly happy. Dude, this house is looking badass. Who up fucking their house? Tater, wait, is it 3 a.m. for- Go to bed! Go to bed! 20 of these. There we go, beautiful. House fucker. So, and, so, and. One, two. Dude, I love, um, Peppered Deep Slate. This block is, like, so fucking cute. You still haven't fixed your house? Gamer Curl, what does it look like I'm doing? Walks towards you way too quickly. Walks towards you literally way too quickly for it to be comfortable. Put. Put. Oh no. Oh no! Wait, have you fucked the house this stream yet? And what about that? Okay, let's see. What other blocks could I cook up? Um, more cobblestone, please. Okay, okay. I think we're gonna hit uh, a quick BRB around here. Does that sound good? Would everyone survive if we hit a quick BRB? If we hit a quick BRB, would you survive? Oh, I hiccuped. Okay, BRB. Why did you post Scrat Ina in my DMs? I assume that I assume that's her name. Scratina? Mmm. Mmm. <sighs> Jamie, know you're getting your baby bells, you can't fool us. No, I'm literally just drinking my damn water, like bigly. Mmm. Hey! Human person lad. Thank you for thank you for complimenting my throbber. I actually worked hard on it. It's it was fun. I wanted to be like I've seen people do uh I it was Kaba actually. I saw Kaba do a loading a loading screen thing in um uh Blender and I was like, "Oh, that's cool. I want to make my own loading screen thing." So I made this throbber. It's literally called a throbber. It throbs. Look at it. Watch it throb. Jane, what are your feeling on lemonade? Oh my god, I love strawberry lemonade so fucking much. Strawberry lemonade is so good, it's normal lemonade to me. I mean, normal lemonade is also good, but like, strawberry lemonade is my lemonade. Due to its... Due to its good? Due to how yummy? Is that okay? Would you be mad at me if that was true? I love lemonade! I love lemonade too. Strawberry lemonade is my favorite. I don't know when the last time I had normal lemonade is. 
I don't know what that like voice crack squeak thing was that came out of my throat, but if I could do it on command, I totally would, and I would like be the most obnoxious voice actor on this side of the earth, and they would put me in literally fucking everything. Hmm. Oh, I have an idea. Yup, my little leaf tunnels I live in. I'm like the leaf hog. I'm literally like the leaf hog. I'm imagining you being put into a blender, being put into a freezer to solidify, then taken out and <laughs> put back up again into a puddle? Why are you imagining that? How come you're imagining that? What if that was someone's first time chat? What if Soppy goes into someone else's chat, it says that, and gets banned for life? And it's like one of those like moderation networks, so you get banned from eight different streams, you know? Well, what if you get banned from like the president's stream because you say that? Imagine. Welcome to my world. My name is James 70 and I'm running for president. Hey, get out of my house. My name is James 70 and get out of my house. My name is James 70 and get out of my president. James, can you drown in the water, please? Nuh-uh. I need... Hold on. I need to explore. I need to explore and find a damn nether portal, because I don't want to go underground again. But before I... before I implore, what I need to get is a compass, and I believe I have the materials for it. Everyone, use exclamation point believe if you do too. Okay, I'll use those as my traveling foods. I'll take my fishing rod with me because it's my fishing rod. Close that. Don't doubt. Hmm. Don't be skeptical. What are you doing in my basement and how? Not you, chat. If you were here next to me, I'd be, like, mad and freaked out as well, but, like, for different reasons. You should have told me you were coming over. I would have cleaned up, and we could play, uh, we could play painting, and we could play hopping. You should check your basement. I'm in it right now. You, get, you can't in your walls. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> the drink I'm drinking bit me. You can't in your walls me, because if somebody was in my walls, I'd be really excited, because then we would be able to hang out and play with toys. And that would be fucking awesome. You literally, it would be incredibly difficult to in your walls me, I'm so sorry. I'm sorry to all the haters who will try, but if there was a scary guy, well, that's just, that's just like Jeff the Killer or Smile the Dog to me. And not one, not that scary, two, you know what, if there was like, if there was a PNG, if there was a malicious PNG that could make you die, that could hurt you so bad you die, it wouldn't be that bad to like just hang out with, right? Can we play War Hamster? We totally can. If you snuck into my walls and lived in there, you could totally play War Hamster. Whee! You're making shit up. What do you mean? Peep the horror? What? This is why we send the ants in instead, not not people on the walls. <laughs> Soppy doesn't know that I haven't seen an ant in months. Okay, I want to get up this hill, but I don't want to get mulched by a critter, so I'm going to do so carefully. Chat, do not deploy the terrible mulchers right now. I do not want to be terribly mulched. They're gathering in great numbers. Well, I don't want that to be true. It's an ant's world, we're just living in it. I actually disagree. I think that the world belongs to a much larger animal. Octopus, dolphin, kuwaka, um, lizard maybe, beetle. I believe the beetle is the most numerous animal by volume. So I think you'll have to take your ant propaganda back to the ant kingdom. <laughs> Giraffe world? Nuh-uh. They may be tall, but they're not smart. They don't own anything. Ow, my ass! Where'd it- fucker. Dude, stop. Why are you- 
Why do you get to deal triple damage? Man. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. This thing's got teeth. Haha. <laughs> oh, fuck. Now you can't get me. Shit! Oh, my God. Yeah, you are fucked, idiot. Holy shit. I need to have more food in my inventory that isn't just a melon slice. God damn. That thing almost got me. Okay, little buddy, now I'm going to end your life. Thank you. Hey, who's stealing my nectar? I just felt some of my nectar leave my body. Who's stealing it? Hey. Is someone stealing my nectar right now? If you say yes, I'll be mad. Don't mulch me. Oh my god, that little bunny scared me so bad. Retweet if you would have shit yourself. Hmm. I don't know where exactly the spawn of this world is. See, I'm following this damn little compass. If it's much farther, I'm probably gonna give up on following it to spawn. You know? Because I'd like it if I could just set my spawn somewhere, or I'd like it if I could set my compass somewhere easily. But we only have, like, those damn astral compasses or whatever in this game. The, the fuckers that, uh... Wait, hold on! It's spun! That means spawn is, like, literally right around here. Right? Oh my god, it totally is. It's, like, literally right here. Holy shit. Okay, okay. Yeah, this is, I, I was, like, reaching my limit in terms of running through stupid forests and shit. Okay, okay. I will make a big beacon here, right? That way, I will know, um, what way to go to get back to my house whenever a compass leads me here. Ah, oh, man. Everybody, let's use the command, uh, exclamation point. Jamie is so smart at this game. Going back for spawning season A? Come on, man. Oh, it's so beautiful. Oh, it's- That's what I needed! That's what I needed! I needed that pool! Okay, okay! We're- we're getting- Oh, I got up here and then didn't think of get down. I can survive a fall at that height, right? Ow! Didn't hurt that bad. Ow! Stop using all those bad- Why'd you use exclamation point big and round? Hey. Hey. No inflation fanatics in the chat, okay? I don't have an alliance with them. I- I have an, uh... What's, like, the opposite of an alliance? What's, like, uh... When you, like, swear enemies and to, like, another kingdom? What is that called? Because I have whatever that is with gooners. I'm a, I am an enemy of the Gooner Kingdom. Uh, nothing wrong with- nothing wrong with the Edging Kingdom, okay? I'm not allied to the Gooners. I've said this before, I'll say it again. Our kingdoms are at war. Jame, rival of Gooners. Yeah, literally. If you were big and around that- <laughs> at that height, you would have bounced, actually? Mario did that? Yeah, Marx invented that, and then Mario stole it for his own book. Das Mushroom. Let's see. Okay. How much farther do I have to go? I need a, like, a little bridge across here because- Oh, I don't have enough toys to build shit. Wouldn't it be Das Coin? Yeah, it probably would, but I didn't know anything about Mario or Das Capital to make a, a joke where they're friends. Um... Dude, are Mario and Das Capital still friends? I don't see them stream or talk anymore. Are they still friends? Hey, did anyone notice? Hmm. Compost? Why do we- why is this here? No. No. Okay. I thought I was at the wrong village for a second. I got so scared. I thought that farm over there was my fucked up version of the farm. Who keeps leaving my damn doors open? I am going to have to switch it to killer door. Why aren't these oxidizing? Hold on. Chat, what's going on here? 
Why isn't this oxidizing? What is happening? Explain. I didn't wax these, no. They're close together because it's inside, but the front doors aren't... Put some water on it, maybe? I guess that's actually not a bad idea. Hmm. They're healthy? I waxed? Don't do that! I'm trying to get- I'm trying to get a beautiful greenhouse going. I hiccuped. Two buckets should be enough to get you through a game, right? If they're closer together, they're slower to oxidize. Hmm. Hmm. Right, right, because the best copper oxidization farms always have them all far away from each other. Right, right, I'm remembering this now. I didn't know that would, like, do the same to, like, grates and stuff. That's cool, though. That's a neat feature. Hey, don't scrump me. What the hell? Why are you scrumping me? Stop! What the hell? Did anyone notice? Can't help but notice your house still looks fucked up. Do you have eyes? Do you have eyes, Hornsby? Clearly you don't. Because my house is looking so beautiful. Look at this awesome basement so far. Okay, we are gonna go get that lava first thing tomorrow, I think, because I don't want to explore the terrible depths of what this game can throw at me at night. It would look better with less cobble. That seems like a silly thing to say when it's not true. It would look better with more mossy cobble, I think is what you mean to say. Oh, and, and more trapdoors. Mm -hmm. Hey, why is Hornsby able to talk? Holy shit. Oh my god. Good fucking point. Give me a second. I need to not time out the wrong person. There we go. Get out of here, Hornsby. Back to the spawning pools with you. Grass block. No cracked cobble. <laughs> Shaking my head. Dude, I wish they would add more, like, cobble variants. I want a wet- I want wet cobblestone. I want dripping cobblestone. I can say that because they added dripstone. Let's see. Put that there. No. Boneless cobble. You can't get anything boneless on Earth because everything- Like, listen. Everything on Earth has died at some point. Somewhere in a vicinity that is inconvenient. So, like, by that metric, right? You can't go anywhere without being near, like, a dinosaur, Adam. You know? When did you die? No, I mean, like... I mean, okay, no. Uh... Wrong. Does concrete have bones to you? Everything has bones to me, that's what I'm saying. Like, literally, you can't go anywhere on Earth without there being, like some sort of bone atom element, you know? Because everything is inherently connected. You know? James, why are you what's with the little dots? I think this is a poignant and true statement. This is fucked up? Well, yeah, if you're scared of skeletons, I'm not particularly scared of them. I mean, they're freaky. It's cool. Everything on Earth has died at some point. I mean... Yeah, like, animals, every- every sheep has or will die at some point. I mean, has- not has. Like, it's, it's in a species sense. There is no immortal species of Earth is what I mean. There is no immortal species of Earth. Name an immortal species of Earth. A <laughs> sheep will die on every page. Sharks? No, okay, but like, name an immortal species where no of its kind, where none of its kind have ever died is what I mean. Like, yes, something can live a long time. Nothing has never not died. You're following now. You're understanding. And what of the humble sturgeon? I hate to break it to you, but there was a humble sturgeon that did die. I don't know their name. I don't know where they're from. <laughs> Jim is the first hyper-mortal species. Hey! Don't say- don't say I'm extra mortal just because I'm weak. There is a literal jellyfish called the immortal jellyfish. They do not die. Oh my god. They can die is what I'm saying. They are capable of dying. Maybe not of old age. 
They literally can't. That's not true. That's not true. Oh, human person lad said that. Sorry. Okay. Okay. Sorry. I was getting trolled. I was getting Tails Gets trolled. Have you guys seen the new Lego... Have you guys seen the new <laughs> Lego Shadow set? Because somebody pointed out that it looks exactly like a Tails Gets Trolled's drawing. Hold on. Hold on. We're gonna go play. I want to play Image with you guys for a second. Uh, let me go get this for you. Lego Shadow the Hedgehog. I promise I don't follow Lego Shadow, Lego Sonic releases, but I was unable to avoid this one because it looks, well, it looks awesome. Let's all look at it. Did you pause your mind? Uh, I'm safe in the basement. I'll be fine. If I, if I die from looking at Lego Shadow the Hedgehog, I kind of deserve it. Let's all be completely fair. Come on, .png, nobody likes a webp. Here, everyone. We're about to get happy and we're about to view image together. Look at this thing. Look at this fucking thing. Come on, everyone. Look at it even more. Doesn't it look exactly- doesn't it look exactly like Tales of Gets Trolled? Literally somebody- somebody said that on the Tumblr dash and I- it made me laugh so much. It made me giggle. Jim, can you animate that to be your avatar? Come on everyone, it's me Shadow. No. Why would I do that? I'm not- I'm not a Shadow fan. That would be a really fun game to play on stream. Shadow the Hedgehog. What game is that even from? I mean, not Shadow. I mean, like, what era? What console is Shadow the Hedgehog game where he gets guns? What a badass idea. What if, what if Sonic was a bad dude? What if Sonic was a bad dude with a rude attitude? GameCube? Fuck, I'm gonna have to find my GameCube. Say I if you think James should Animorph into Lego Shadow the Hedgehog. It would hurt all of my bones if I do that, um, so don't say yes, please. Thank you. Stop saying yes. Oh, this house fucking rocks. I say to my own house that I'm actively building. I want dirt. Do you want a video playlist of every single cutscene permutation in Shadow the Hedgehog? <laughs> I think I'm good. Imagine me backing away, like, visibly terrified. Imagine me backing away with the terror of a thousand seals. Seals are- seals a naturally scared animal. I feel like seals would be scared of a lot of things. They seem like an animal that would be frightened of loud noises. The correct choice. You get the grill. Yay! Yay! Seals are brave? Oh, I'm so fucking glad to hear that. If you had told me that seals were cowardly, I would have been upset. Seals are so brave, I'm really fucking happy. Your understanding of the animal kingdom is corrupt. <laughs> the Jamie Wamey is the most scared animal ever? Why did- <laughs> Why- <laughs> Why did you add a W? <laughs> what the fuck? Are you making your floor dirt on purpose? Yeah. It's a good material. Look at that. Fear 7T? Stop. Look at how- look at how nice that looks! I'm really happy. And one of you has to get happy per second with me, okay? Or else we're gonna have another killing situation! Smiles really widely, walks towards you with obvious intent. It looks like something won't say what? Yay! You won't say what? Yay! Yay. Yay. I could use another dirt pile in this corner of my room. That's what the Beatles said before their doom. That's my new children's book. It will be out in September. I am hiring an AI artist to do all the art, and it seems like it's taking a while. Um, because he doesn't like me very much, and I don't like him either. But the studio contracting me for the book said I only had a budget of eight pennies and a beautiful ant. And I'm keeping the damn ant. 
<laughs> bingo voice, bingo. Stop that. Not cool. Not fucking cool. <laughs> me putting dirt piles in my house because it makes me happy. <laughs> Smiley face. <laughs> Can we pin bingo bows? No, we have to pin dirt piles. We can pin bingo later. We have to pin dirt piles. It made me smile too much not to pin, okay? Why didn't, what? What? Why can't I do anything with deep slate? This block is perverse. Can we pin Jane to the bottom of the ocean? Talking about pinning again? Hi, Soppy, what's up? How come that summoned you, huh? How come? I could make a little underwater fishing area down here. Oh shit, if I make an underwater fishing area then- Wait, no, it's daytime, I need to go get two buckets of lava. Or something. No, I have to go get any lava. Wait, no, obsidian, that's what I need. Fuck, I'm burning daylight, heavily. I'm heavily pregnant with nighttime. I'm on a certain trimester. I don't know how many trimesters there are. <gasps> Three! Because it has tri in the title! Like the droid tri-fighter from Star Wars! Oh, fuck yeah. Don't ever say George Lucas didn't teach us anything. You can learn how many months pregnant you are using the droid tri-fighter. <laughs> don't comment sad stream. <laughs> Fucker. I would actually laugh if it wasn't three. There's no, there's, there's no, f you can't be in the fourth trimester, right? Of pregnant? You probably can't. You can learn anything. Jim, if you have dripstone cauldron, you only need one bucket and then you can have many lava buckets. That is true. That's why I'm taking two buckets. One bucket for the lava on top of the lava and another bucket to keep it, take it home with me. Wait, hold on. But if I keep it, take it home with me and do two things at once. Oh, I could totally get way- b Oh, I'm lost in the forest. Hold on. Train of thought. Recalibrate. Hold on. There it is. That- that's gonna be over there. <laughs> no, James, there is no fourth trimester. I love how unsure about that you are, James. <laughs> I didn't- Everybody was mad at me. Everybody was mad at me figuring out what trimester meant. Three? So, I thought maybe it was a misnomer for a second. Jane, can you craft a silly stone bucket? I'll try my damn best, but everybody is, like, killing me with hammers, nails, and possibly even more terrible little things. Okay, take this. Now do this. Yup, and it's beautiful the whole time the lava's dying. Okay. Now, I think the most effective way to do this would be put that there, and then... Yep, yep, and then just leave the water there. You can walk on lava today, try it. <gasps> yes, please, yes, please, yes, please, yes, please. Happy. I should make a cobblestone farm because that would be way easier than mining cobblestone. Wait, holy shit. Could I make the most effective fucking thing ever and combine a cobblestone farm and a lava generator? Like have lava at the very top and do the other thing? Jane, make up a new type of ore from Minecraft. Oh, I already have it. It's gonna be critter ore. When you break it, it, it's like a little hopping blob and you pick it up and if you combine enough of them, you can craft different mob eggs. If you craft like critter ore, if you smelt it into critter stone or whatever, and then uh, put bones around it, it turns into skeleton egg. Jane, this already exists? No, it does it litter- it very much doesn't. <gasps> no, no, my egg! My egg tried to escape! Ooh. Come on, everybody. Imprison your egg! <laughs> At least critter ore exists, the silverfish blocks? Okay, but that's- that's silverfish specifically, and only silverfish. You literally can't get anything else out of it, ever. That's just the ore spawn mod. Disclaimer, do not search the ore spawn mod. Huh. I 
am genuinely scared and not gonna ask any other questions. I think the best thing you can do is be like scared and upset by like a passing leviathan beneath the ice, but ultimately not care about it. I'm not looking at it at all. Going for my purring and meowing session, rot? Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you, Soppy, fuck you. Sorry, I was mad because you're going for a purring and meowing session, and I'm not at the moment. But I will be later, so not my fucking problem. Yeah, find your sunbeam, man. Find your beautiful sunbeam. Huh? What about that? Chat, do not educate each other about the ore spawn mod, because I will be able to see it too, and I don't want to know anything. I want to know nothing. If you want to if you want to play learning, go play learning elsewhere. I don't wanna know. I wanna play blocks. I wanna I wanna find my toy. You do know nothing? Hey fuck you. Hey fuck you, buddy. Oh wait, that's hold on, that's Hornsby. Oh I almost timed out Soppy. Hold on. Get out of here. My sunbeam is more hot and in the sun for more of the day than yours and your soap is Oh fuck, I'm timing you out too, man. You're not- you're not allowed to brag about- you're not allowed to brag about how much better your sunbeam is. Man, this is fucked. I live in hell. Can't believe he has a better and more warm sunbeam. Can you fucking believe this? This is fucked. You accidentally timed out Soppy and horns me. <laughs> Aw, that's so sweet. You think I'm James Evan Merciful tonight? That's so sweet collateral it happens i i place out a a banning bomb in the chat and it gets random chat members that would be fun let's add that chat exclamation point banning bomb and i'll i'll ban everybody permanently but only once come on get in my damn pocket Okay, are we- uh, is 14 obsidian enough to do, like, everything you need in Minecraft, or do I need 15? I forget. How much do I need for a nether portal and the other thing that I want? Uh, a happy damn table. Not what it's called, but, like, I'm not in the mood to think. Okay, two lava buckets. You need 34. Man, I don't believe you. I'm gonna get this last one. You need 10 for a nether portal, and you need, like, f 3, 4. You need 3, 4. 4? Or 3? You need 4. Okay, so you need a minimum of, like, 14. Okay. There. So 16 is enough. Either 16 is enough, or I have successfully outwitted uh, somebody trying to trick me. Oh no, game math, here we go. Hey! 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 If you ignore the corners of another portal, you need 10. Okay, okay. So I've actually got enough, and I don't need to ignore two of the corners of another portal, it sounds like. So I can have a better nether portal than average, but not like the best. It's fine. Bwitty, Bwitty, you're trying to trick me. You're trying to trick me, Bwitty, and it's not going to work. You may think that it's going to work, but it's not. Oh no, I fall. Didn't even care, by the way. Safe. Safe forever. Yep. And by the way, I would survive any climactic event in a movie. If you shoot a big stupid beam up into the sky, I am going to survive that shit easily. If history has told us anything, it's that whenever a big stupid beam shoots up into the sky, you're gonna be fucking fine. It's gonna be solved within like 30 minutes. Like less than that, usually. Nobody shoots a big beam in the sky when there's, like, 31 minutes of mo of a movie remaining. Unless it's, like, the exposition and the big beam happened decades ago. In which case, you are kind of fucked. If you're living in, like, a post-action movie Lost World, like, if you're living in, like, uh, a future where, like, the, the aliens from Men in Black got what they wanted, which I don't know what they wanted, I don't know. A, a, a beam? What single movie does any of this happen? Men in Black, I assume, but I could be wrong. I assume the aliens in Men in Black shoot a big beam in, into the sky, right? 
Right? They have to. Nether portals don't even need 10 anymore. Can make smaller portals. That's not true, Plobber. You're trying to trick me. That's not true. Great and beautiful name, but you're trying to trick me. <laughs> oh, this is going to be beautiful. I haven't watched Men in Black, <laughs> but I also believe that. Let's go. The end of Men in Black is trying to get on a ship to escape Earth because it hates it there. Mib 2 has the beam. See? If, if you're ever looking for something to watch with a, uh, a potential sweetie of yours, a wife, girlfriend, boyfriend, other variations of those, go ahead and watch Men in Black 2, because it's got the beam. Yup, Mib 2. It's got the beam. Again, don't understand why they fire me for all the marketing of anything, but whatever. I don't have any dripstone, so this isn't working. Now I look like a dumbass, and I've just made sort of a useless pile. Good job, Jamie. Well, I'm storing that down there for now because I can't be asked. I don't know where to get dripstone other than cave of it. I don't know if I saw any dripstone cave of. Don't boil me in tar, chat. This is not the this is not the medieval punishment stream. And even if it was. You guys would take it way too far. You guys would get, like, sexual about it. You, you would tar and feather me, and somebody in the chat would be like, Ah, do it again. Fuck. Biting lip emoji. Don't post the biting lip emoji. There is nothing more disgusting than the biting lip emoji. Imagine if you post that right now. Hmm. Leather. Paper. And another ingredient for a, a book. Hey, Jane, can you go inside this shiny brass cow statue? That's not even a punishment. That's just, like, what they did to the, um... Uh... Guys in the Bible, right? No, no, wait. Were they worshipping a golden cow? No, not a golden goose. So that's literally... Is brass gold? Is brass a type of gold? No, it isn't. I'm looking over at my producer, which is me in a different hat, and they're shaking their head. Brass is not gold. Jim, have you ever been to torture history class ever? Uh-uh. Nope. Why are you all saying I'm doomed? It's an alloy? Ooh. <laughs> only asking some deep questions to stream how many trimesters are there <laughs> and is brass gold <laughs> I'm glad somebody notices my wisdom and my genius look I made the enchantment table from memory that's how you know I'm smart no other way you couldn't tell any other way opinion on the word gulch uh, it's fine. It's a fine word. I like a gulch. I prefer- I prefer a valley over a gulch, okay? And I- let's be completely clear. I think everybody agrees when I say I prefer a valley over a gulch. You would? I bet you do. Easily scammable streamer. What are you talking about? Opinion on the word glinch? Borderline sexual. Thank you. How many bookshelves do you need now? Um, because back in ye olden days, it was a torturous amount. It was the devil's number. Um, but now it's only borderline torturous. Don't throw stones at me, I'm just a little thing. Stop. If you throw stones at me, I might die if they hit me. So, cut it out? Thanks. Like, 17? Good lord. It's like a bookshelf is full of books or something. Gross. It went. Two. Okay, let's see. Can I enchant this? I can. I'm gonna make a stronger pickaxe. I'm gonna make a stronger pickaxe. That was my rhythmless song that I've sung to scare away bees and vampires. Two of the animals that are afraid of rhythmless. Efficiency, unbreaking, or efficiency? Efficiency. Fuck. Wait, plus two mining efficiency? What? They label that shit now? Really? Cool. Fix your floor, please. Okay. No mending, doomed streamer. 
Doomed streamer, doomed streamer. Hmm. Iron axe. Get rid of that. One, two, three. Mendel it. I actually agree. Mending is like the iPhone of the Minecraft world. People can't survive without it these days. What did you all do before you had mending, huh? What did you all do before you got your Apple iMend, huh? That was a loaded sentence? Let's take that apart? <laughs> no, you leave, my, you leave my sentence completely intact and you think about what you've done. You think about what you've done. I never made diamond tools? Oh, why? Did you not like them? Are you and Diamond Tools friends anymore? Okay. This is gonna be awesome. So we're gonna put a stone cutter here. We're gonna put a blast furnace here. And that's beautiful, right? But then we're gonna put a furnace nowhere. I don't wanna put a furnace there. My headphones died. Can you repeat the loaded sentence? Of course. Here. And they're all yelling at me for saying the truth, which is just cruel. Wouldn't you agree? I think you would. Get out of the way. Oh, it's so beautiful. No, play the damn game. Fuck you. Wait, Hornsby, how'd you get out of here? Oh, this is so beautiful. Oh no, it's wet now. Fuck. Okay, now it's beautiful again. Players joining after 1.9 can't survival. All they know is keep inventory, mending, enchantment, shield, a light or riptide dryden, and die. Oh, and lie. You could have replaced lie with die because you said survival. I would have allowed it. I think a lot of other people would too. You're not in trouble for not doing that though. Other people might put you in trouble, but I wouldn't. Because I'm nice, remember that, I'm nice. My name is Jamie, I am merciful. Okay, it's nighttime out there. My house is beautiful in here. It needs more greenery though. Oak leaves, I summon you to this battle. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah! Yeah! I love my leaves. I love my leaves, they're so cute. Everybody smile. If you're not if you're not in the mood to smile, you can do something stupid. Leaflet? Okay, you are getting you are getting ground up into paste. One, two, three. Mm-hmm. This could do this could do with some work over here. I'm sure nobody noticed. I don't like this. We also need to figure out where that last villager is and either torture him until he complies or give him a job, I guess. How do you make librarians? Go to hell? Why? Blink, blink. Why are you mean to me? Blink, blink, blink. Blink sweatly. Go up here. I don't need a map, do I? Oh, sugar cane. That's what I needed. There. Put that there. And put that there. Okay. Now with two more cartography tables, we will have plenty of cartographers. Oh, is this a new world? Did you finally perish? Nope, not a new world at all. Check it out. Same world, same beautiful world. We are currently working on making my house emprettied. It's working, I'm sure you noticed. Uh, but chat doesn't see my vision yet. See, look at how beautiful it is down here. I.E. very. Mm -hmm. Same world, same broken house. Not true. Why am I hearing villagers so much more clearly when I'm down here? Did one of them sneak into my house? Where am I hearing you from? Where is he? Uh, 
I hear him. I assume you do too, chat. But it is unclear where he is. Oh. You know what? That makes sense. You need lecterns for librarians, by the way. Yeah, that's true. I was working on making... What are they called? Map makers. Oh, no! <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> Literally 1986. Literally 1986. <laughs> Fuck. House complete? Fuck. Where, let me go home. Let me spectate world. What is this? What are you doing? I can't spectate world like this. Hold on. Oh my god, I had to- I not even opt? I'm not even opt on my own world? I can't do it. I can't do anything. Hold on. Single player, go back there. I need to get screenshots of my damn world. How do I open this thing to land? This wouldn't happen in Skyrim. D not even true. Hold on. Allow commands on. There we go. Slash game mode creative. There. Slash game mode spectator. Oh, but now but now I can load in chunks or whatever. This game is literally trying to hurt me really badly. In all of my bones. Whatever. I'm so mad. I'm so mad. I'm so... I'm... I don't know if you can't tell how mad I am right now. What day were you on? Oh, man. What day was I on? Day 24! I was literally almost a fourth of the way. Why would you punch a villager right next to a golem? I wasn't- I didn't even do that. What I was trying to do was break a fence. Like, right there. I was trying to break a fence post. So the fucking golem would get out of the way. And look at that. These ter- these terrible, horrible- they- they- I built them a house? I built myself a house and look at what they did. Look at what they did to me, chat. Terrible. Very bad to do to Jamie's. Not healthy. Not healthy for your Jamie's. Bunch of silly guys? I agree. Bad of them to do. Can't you spawn in, like, normal this way and keep going despite the stupid death? We won't tell on you? You will, though. You will tell on me, though. And it would be cruel and wrong of you to do. We will? We won't? <laughs> They threw themselves at your fist and raged the golem? I- I literally don't even think that happened. I accidentally murdered it. <laughs> Purred and meowed awesome style, got a slice of ham treat, and you went and got stupid L. <laughs> Fuck you, zombie. Aw, oh, man. I would, but I would also judge you for it. You're hell. You're hell to me. I'm feeling genuine grief over this world. Don't worry, little buddy. I can I can keep playing this world, but our journey to find a beautiful world where James 70 lives 100 days continues. I was literally just thinking the other day, like, oh man, I want to go play my Minecraft world. I wish it wasn't uh, hardcore so I could play it whenever I wanted. Um, but now I can play it whenever I want. Now I can play it whenever I want. Also, hello, this is my first James stream. What is happening? I have been attempting to survive... 100 days on a Minecraft hardcore world. It is a very popular thing for people who have apparently done literally everything in Minecraft to do, right? I've never done it. I've played Minecraft for many years. I've never survived for 100 days on the kill version of this world, of this game. I'm punishing this guy. Fucker. You are being removed from my world.
there. Okay, now I'm happy. Well, that explains why they were making all that noise there. Okay, okay. World is over, house is beautiful. You have to understand house is beautiful. Oh yeah, you have to add a mod now? That is correct, human person, lad. That is absolutely correct. The trick about this uh, series is, starting from now, every time I die, I have to add at least one mod to my world. And Sunday should be interesting because I believe I'll be adding a handful of mods. No. Hey, hold up, now the world is done for, can't you spawn infinite TNT and blow up shit for fun? Yeah, but I don't want to. Uh, now I'm just gonna use this as a single player world. I love, I love my house, it's so beautiful. Skyrim mod? Gamer Curl, is there a Skyrim mod? I am not adding the Big Naturals mod. I am not adding the- You are trying to trick my damn ass if you want a Big Naturals mod. Indulge in your destructive urges? I don't really have those. I'm a- I'm a sweetie pie. You have to understand. I- I don't want to, uh, kill my entire earth. I love this world. I just wanted to hurt that one guy really badly. I think that's fair to do. Estrogen mod. Oh, that's a good one. We could estrogenize. Who up- Who up doing estrogen moment? Let's see. There you go. Now your worm workers can play, and it's like you've minimized me in the background. Chest cavity, add chest cavity? What does that mean? I don't know anything about Minecraft mods, but Aether mod sounds interesting to me. Aether could be cute. Aether could be sweet. I feel like I would die. Wait, Aether mod is like really difficult. I don't know if that's a good idea. There's a mod that makes you a spider. Hmm. I don't know how that would help. Wait, no, that would help me. No, that wouldn't help me survive, would it? It's called the Ender Scrolls game, and it's the Skyrim mod? That would be pretty funny. You're waking up in nine hours? No, I'm not. It's a Saturday. I'm not fucking doing that. Origins, maybe? Make you as small as real life? If I was the Inchling Origin, I would be... I would be killable in, like, one hit. That would be such a... Uh bad idea for me because I would- No, don't say good to that! It would be a one episode series! A skeleton would see me and I would die. I'm- I was so happy with- Okay, hold on, give me a second. Let's- let's enlarge me for a smack. I was so happy with how this world was going along. Look at how cute. Look at how cute. You should do the thing that lets chat control your Minecraft blocklet. What is the Minecraft blocklet? Because if you're talking about my character in game, that's interesting. What is- or is- is a blocklet a different mob you can get? I'm very interested in the humble blocklet all of a sudden. Also, my house is beautiful. I'm glad everyone literally noticed here at the very end. The moss, the beautiful, the pretty. That's just what I was calling your character. Yup, and you called it the blocklet. No, it is not top 10 deserved fates. Away with you, little Hornsby. Hmm. I mean, this is definitely the farthest we've gotten. I had, like, farm set up. I had ocean. Maybe... Maybe living in a village is a little bit of a double-edged sword, I'm realizing. I should not rely on the village so much. But also, it's such a good start, is the thing. I, I guess I'll just never make this little type of railway again, you know? You know? You have a pretty nice house, to be honest. Hey, thank you, Ad Normal. I think it was beautiful. Oh yeah, the new Twitch app sucks because they tried to make half of it TikTok. Yeah, we were talking about that at the beginning of the stream. It sucks so bad. I, a streamer, was trying to get back to a stream I was on to let them know that my entire power just went out. And it was like, oh, do you want to watch these eight other people that you're following? And it's like, yes, some other time. Right now you have to let me choose who I want to watch because I'm actively trying to explain to people that I didn't just get exploded. I'm trying to let them all know I'm alive. We can think of that later. Oh no, now I'm gonna get really embarrassed. Hi, Gorilla Radio Show Raiders. I just died in my game. 
I just died in my game badly. Wait, Raiders, hey. Raiders, listen, grabs you all by the throat. Grabs you. What do you think of this house? Honest answers only. What do you think of this beautiful house, huh? No rip, very nice, thank you. Radio Pleb, that's a good name. <gasps> oh, Octarine Glow, I love that gif, that's awesome. Good, okay. Well now, no, what do you think of this? It, isn't this the best fucking basement you've ever seen? I was not punched, I did not punch a villager. I did not punch a villager. Chat, I did not <laughs> punch a villager, okay? What, what happened, okay? What happened was, there was an iron golem stuck right here, okay? There was an iron golem stuck right here. And it, it killed me because I tried to break a fence gate. Creative mode, shaking my head. This was a hardcore world. I've lost. I'm not allowed to play it anymore. It's, it's over and done, tragically. Here comes the revisionism. I'm not revising anything. I, chat, you can go, you can go see. You can go look, okay, at the VOD. What happened was I tried to break a single fence post after, like, beyond the Iron Golem. And because he was stupid, because the Iron Golem was an idiot, he got in my way, I realized what was about to happen, and only had enough time to scream no before getting crunched in the face and getting killed. Thank you. VOD watchers find James Seven's lies. I didn't lie. I didn't lie. You don't need you don't need to call a referee. I would not lie about this because I was not punching my vill villagers. Look at them. I uh, okay, never mind. Look at nothing. Okay, yeah, look at nothing forever. <laughs> look at nothing ever again. Okay? You're talking about your excuses and are gradually getting much smaller right now. Not a good look. Man, fuck off. Fuck you. You had full iron armor. I'm surprised you got killed in one shot. I didn't know they did so much damage. It's because it's cause they cheated. It's because they cheated is what happened. Literally, I had such a good town. Look at this. This is where I grew uh, vines. I didn't have anywhere else in particular that I grew vines from, but this is where I grew them here in this town, and it's beautiful. Here's my pile of leaves. That's awesome. And look at this. Little tunnels down there, okay? I even had a book to read. And now it's all gone. You need to choose a mod to add. Could you do a poll to decide? I could. I could do a poll. There, we have, we have various options. But part of me is wondering if I shouldn't just do that off stream. And maybe just poll the discord. Once I find some. Is this a survival server? This is a single player world and I died badly. So it is no longer going to be mine. Or it's no longer going to be used in the stream. I've been doing a series where I try to survive for 100 days because apparently that's a popular YouTube thing, right? And I haven't been able to do it. I got to what, 24 days this time? I literally almost got a fourth of the way few through. Jame is a part of the woke left, true. We're going to do a whole big woke raid. Everybody, everybody jump and clap and prepare your woke agenda. I don't know. I don't know what we use. I'm out of the, I'm out of the memo. They don't invite me to meetings. They don't invite me to the Antifa meetings. So like single life? Yeah, it's, it's a hardcore Minecraft world. So when you die, you're not allowed to use it anymore. You explode and then you're not alive. Hmm. Yeah, I mean, I guess that's I guess that's the beautiful uh end of this world. Upsetting. Look at that. We had two light gray wool in that chest. And look at that. We had a music disc. But it's all gone. It's all gone forever now. Well, sad. Whatever. Let's see. What are some good mods, chat? Don't list boobs mod again. 
<laughs> oh my god, you worked 50 hours in the hamburger mines for that music disc. I literally did. I don't get to fucking survive. Create. People have been wanting me to do a create one. Boobs mod, come on! Farmer's Delight. That sounds very cute. Check the Minecraft channel. Okay. Skitters over rather quickly. If this is going to be a link to the Skyrim mod, I will laugh a little bit. Oh, uh, it is literally the Elder Scrolls Skyrim craft. Okay. That's it. You're going to Skyrim hell. Okay, okay. I think what we'll do is... Sunday... How about one with curvaceous body... Why are you on a... Uh, I think what we'll do is Sunday is probably going to be a little special event stream. I'll be doing a series of Minecraft Hardcore Worlds with probably a lot of mods. Probably a lot of them. And uh, as well as a Twitch spawn and or crowd control. Because I, I need to raise a coin or two before my hiatus, just so my subscriptions don't overdraft me. I think that is my plan right now. Sunday we'll do a, a quick little fundraiser thing... It shouldn't have to be too much. It shouldn't have to be too scary. But... Huh. Mm. I literally just drank this stuff, and it was beautiful. What a way to live. I have a job. I have a real job. It's just we live in an economy. Have you ever heard of the economy? Gestures? Looking forward to the 24-hour gubble marathon? Oh, it hurts badly, Chief. They're gonna make me play Gubble again. And they're gonna make it hurt. The jester we live in an economy? Oh, fuck. Say it ain't so. Looking forward to the 42-hour Gubble 2 marathon. Did they make a Gubble 2? Why did they do that? How come they did that? Game Weezer confirmed that doesn't... I don't think that's true. I don't think that's true. Oh, Jim Weezer fan confirmed. I don't think I've ever listened to Weezer. I thought you were calling me Weezer. I misread that message really badly. Thank you. Thank you for enjoying my misreading of your message. I didn't do it right. There's a Gubble Kart Racer. There is a Gubble Kart Racer. That is one of the few things I know about Gubble. Hey, I love that little rat thing running in the corner. Hey, cool. I think it's gonna try and escape, too. Slash raid Duke of Ash. I'm sorry to all... Jumps up and down. I'm sorry to all... Uh, jumps up and down. What am I... Who am I apologizing to? I'm sorry, woman. Oh, no, wait. I'm sorry uh, to all raiders uh, for immediately ending stream. But, uh, listen... The, the beautiful gorilla radio show uh, attacked me with hammers right when it ended. Three levels down? Oh, let's fucking go. Keep going. Keep going. Okay. Never stop grinding. Never stop mining for your favorite streamer. Go find it. Raid message? Jame died. Badly. Jame died, period. Badly. You're gonna find him at some point, chat. You're gonna find your favorite streamer during this raid, uh, parade, okay? It- Hey, maybe it was me, okay? And you'll never see me again, fucker. Telling people to never stop grinding, hashtag awesome. Thank you, Soppy. I actually agree. Everyone, uh, I hope you have a wonderful night. I hope you get really safe. Stay safe, it's storming here. Uh, so don't get caught in the storm that I'm having at my house but get caught in someone else's storm, okay? Uh, pretend that's a song lyric. What's the other thing? Uh, I'll be back Sunday, everyone. And to all the VOD watchers, I won't tell you the secret message yet, but I will in a moment. Bye, raiders! Oh, uh, yeah, no, wait, I told you the raid message. Go say it to Duke. Say hi to Duke. I won't be able to watch Duke. He is streaming Voices of the Void, and he is... Uh, uh, I assume he's gonna get scared or brave. So, say hi, tell him I died badly, and have a good night. Okay, are they all-
all gone? Okay, VOD watchers, listen. I watched, hey, spoilers for the movie, spoilers for the movie, what's it called? Spoilers for the what? Oh my god, what movie did it watch? It was called Trap. It was an M. Night Shyamalan, it was an M. Night Shyamalan movie, okay? It was, uh, called Trap, and it was about, get this, a the police there's a concert right they go to the concert and they're like hey concert lady hey we're gonna trap a serial killer in your concert because we found a clipping of a of a what's it called a little a little receipt that says hey the serial killer is gonna be at the concert it's gonna be yeah, it's gonna be beautiful okay and we're gonna it's gonna it's gonna be fucking awesome they all said to the concert goers and such, right? They all said that. What was the point of the movie again? Anyway, the main character is the serial killer. You follow his perspective. He's there with his daughter watching the uh, concert. He's not even there to hurt anyone, but he is also just a serial killer at the same time. And it's like, well, uh, well, uh, well, well, me, the viewer, I have such a uh, different view of serial killers now. They're, 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 clearly, they're just family men trying to uh, get away. No, you're an idiot if that's your takeaway. Yeah, if you if you fell for the serial killer thirst trap, you're a, a moron. Uh, what the actual message of the movie was, uh, what if uh, what if it happened? What, uh, what if... Eat egg. Oh. Wait, you're not allowed to listen to this. Fuck, this was for the VOD watchers. You came back here and you snooped. You snooped. Now you've been spoiled on... What the movie was called? Trap! You've been spoiled on Trap. This is so fucked. Now we're not even going to survive. Now we're all going to get trapped at a concert and the killer is going to get us. A serial killer's name was The Butcher in the movie. It's such, it's such a Looney Tunes movie. It was literally like a Looney Tunes movie the whole time. Literally, um, what'd they call? What'd they call? It. Huh? Sorry, I'm trying to think of anything from the movie, but I'm realizing that I don't know anything anymore. Hmm. No, they ca they called the serial killer the, uh, the butcher. That's what I was saying. I got confused. Sorry, in my other screen right now, whenever you raid someone, your chat in OBS becomes their chat. So I keep seeing these messages pop up on the side, and it's like, everyone's like, talking about something else. And it's like, why are you talking? Why are you talking? But then on the little stream overlay, I'm seeing like, the real people, uh, uh who came back here illegally talk. Which you shouldn't have done! You're all in trouble. I'm just kidding, you're not in trouble. You could never be in trouble. Anyone know how to get out of here? I can't find the door. <laughs> No, you're trapped. Smiles. Smiles sweetly. I never left. Then what are the point of a raid? Then what are the point of a raid? What's it called? Uh, yeah, have a good night, everyone. Uh, VOD watchers who wanted the, uh, movie spoilers. Good job. Um, you got my opinions on Trap. Uh, wait, did I give you my opinions? Oh, I liked it. It was pretty fun. It was pretty fun. If you wanted to do a more serious deep dive about like the uh, themes of the movie, I could I could pick apart how it's like probably not good OCD representation because that's like kind of that's how the FBI profiler kind of gets the guy a little bit, which is silly. Like it leans a little bit into what's that movie? CIA? No, TV show. C S I, the criminal the criminal guys. And they have, like, the, the dork who, uh, explores and discovers. It's not Steven Universe. Well, you know what, everyone? Think about whatever TV show or movie that I couldn't think of for the rest of the night. Thank you all for watching. It was seriously like a Looney Tunes movie, though. Like, genuinely, they, he just kept squirming out of situations where he should have absolutely gotten his ass, like, got. And major fucking spoilers for the movie Trap right now, but the ending of the movie is literally like a, like a, a comedy scene where he should not have 
gotten out of that. And, like, like that serial killer is, like, looking at the screen and, like, laughing at how absurd it was that he just, like, got out. As, as like, he's laughing with the audience. Not even, like, a... It's not like a Joker, like, <laughs> I did it again, detective. I've escaped your prison of balls. But it's, like, it's, like, genuinely, like, a, oh, fuck, I should not have been able to get out of that. I cannot believe that worked. Which is, like, a, a five... D layer chess on the writers and stuff, but also it's like M Night Shyamalan. So I don't. I, the the point is, it's a movie. You can watch it. I'm not that upset that I lost my world tonight. Like not ter like not terribly upset, but it's like. What's the word? What's the word? It feels fitting. It's like it's like a puzzle piece fit together. This world was never going to survive because it wasn't meant to. It was always meant to be my little world, you know? Something that I play off stream, and whenever I get pissed off, mad, or angry, I just spawn myself in a bow that kills everything in one shot. And now I can do that. Because it is it is no longer for the series. But I'm very excited to start exploring new worlds. Would you say it was doomed? Yes. I would actually say that. They should go back and make new funny um, Pope and Cardinal names. They should make, like, Brother Pepsi. I'd like that a lot. Anyway, my last uh, thoughts on both Trap and my Minecraft world that failed really badly that I embarrassed myself, like, with Iron Golem embarrassment. Um, why didn't the guys in Trap just have an Iron Golem waiting at the door? Were they stupid? 